This is probably gonna take me hours, but I'm gonna try to make a glow-in-the-dark Starbucks cup. I'm putting tape in the cup so the glitter doesn't go everywhere. This is glow-in-the-dark glitter. You can get it on Amazon or Michaels. Oh my god. I'm just gonna do the whole bottle because why not? Now I'm gonna make the snow globe mixture. It's one third cup Elmer's glue and two thirds cup of water. I'm just putting it in the squeeze bottle. Now we're gonna put a mix this up. Okay, here we go. Oh, I think I used too much glitter and everything clumped together. It's gonna take me hours to wash this out, so I'm gonna work on another one in the meantime. I'm just hoping this one doesn't clump because it's really cute. Seal the hole with a cabinet bumper. You can get them at Target. I heard the best way to seal it is with resin. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna pour it on top. <laughs> the resin takes a day to set. Let me show you the potential this cup has. I'm gonna buy some more glitter to fix this, so I will see you tomorrow. Resetting my entire house part five. Now I'm gonna restock the mini fridge. First, I'm filling the mini bottles. Pomegranate cherry juice. This stuff is so good. Next, water. These ones are glass and they're a little bit taller, so I'm just gonna put it in. For fruit, I'm doing mango, blackberries, raspberries, lastly, strawberries. I love fruit. I'm putting these on the bottom shelf. It looks so good. Next, Lunchables, Capri Sun, Yogurt, yeah. Baby Bell Cheese, Coffee. I'm filling the smaller ones with jelly beans. Oh. And chocolate eggs. I didn't know what else to put in here, but this looks good. Next step, I'm organizing my cup collection because it's so Yo, what up? I've never had a snack drawer, so I'm going to try and make one. First, I'm filling the mini containers. Mini m and These are so good. Sour Patch Kids. And Cocoa Pebbles. This is so cute. Now I'm going to fill the bigger ones. First, Oreos. Blue Takis. And Cheez-Its. Oh. Now I'm going to fill the even bigger containers. Anyone else like to snack on waffle cones? This one's going to have fruit snacks. And fruit strips. So excited. Time to put everything in my nightstand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I can properly binge watch Love Island. Goodbye. Yo, what up? I'm finally gonna unpack and organize my new kitchen. I have an island now, by the way. First, I'm organizing all the cups. I think I'll put all the clear ones on one shelf. I don't know. Got my nails done, by the way. I think they're so cute. Little girls. These remind me of being in chemistry. Next shelf's gonna hold my water bottles. And these ones on the other side. Almost forgot about these clear ones. Lastly, all my mugs are going on top. This is my favorite mug. It's so cute, except this part. Why'd they ruin it? Okay, I'm finally done. I'm gonna put my cutting board back and my flower vase. Still have to figure out how to decorate this area, but at least this part's done. Anyways, next I'm organizing my Starbucks cups. I'm so excited. You guys have no idea. Yo, what up? I'm finally gonna unpack my Starbucks cups. I'm so excited. I'm gonna move all this to a different corner and deal with it later. Yay, that's embarrassing. I actually have a lot of space. Now I'm gonna take all the cups out and lay them on the floor. Keep going, but there's too many layers, so there's a problem. I didn't think this through. I don't know what straws go with which cups, so I'm just gonna wing it. This looks kind of right. Now I'm gonna put the keychains next to their matching cup. Okay, kind of. It's not done yet. I still have a lot to do, like putting my lights up. I need to reorganize this because it's not doing it for me. See you in part two. Let's restock my mini fridge, but first I gotta clean it because. <laughs> I'm gonna use Scotch Brite's Advanced Scrub Dots Non Scratch Scrubbers and some soap and water to give it a good deep clean. I dropped chamoy paste so it's super sticky, but look how easy it is to clean. And then use the other side and it's gone. Literally, like what? Next, I'm using Scotch Brite's One Step Disinfectant and Cleaner. It literally does five things all at once. So much better. Now let's stock it. Water, Starbucks Caramel Macchiato, and pomegranate juice, blackberries, and pomegranate seeds. Rapids, pickles, Capri Sun. That's basically it. It's so clean. Also, if you want to try One Step and the Advanced Scrub Dots, you can find them at Amazon or Walmart. Yo, what up? I should be packing, but I'm going to make an ice cream and soda bar instead. First, I'm filling the sprinkles. This one's going to be pink. Found Craig the Flamingo Sprinkles, so I'm mixing those in too. Next, yellow and yellow stars. Purple, green, blue, and some flowers. This one's my favorite. So cute. Oh my gosh. And orange. I'm going to put them on top of this clear tray. This is going to be so cute. Now I'm going to fill the bigger containers. First one's going to have some <laughs> granola, sour punch straws, and the last one's going to hold the ice cream cones. Now I'm gonna put the sodas in these organizers. Got these syrups at Starbucks and they gave me pumps. I'm running out of time, clear shelves. Dried fruit. Well, I tried. I'll see you in part two. And then I'll pack my pantry, which I really don't want to. I'm putting yo it up. I'm going to Coachella. I was invited to Coachella. Like, what? Like me. What is Honey Bow Bear gonna do at Coachella? Probably just like stand there, you know? But it's better. I was also invited to the Neon Carnival by DirecTV. So that happened and I'm so grateful. I'm so excited and I'm packing right now. It's like 3 a.m. And my flight leaves in four or five hours. So let's pack. Got these packing cubes from Amazon and I was able to fit six outfits in this one little cube and then some extra t-shirts and sweaters are in this one. But like, gosh, I did it. Now I just have to close. I have overpacked. These are the nails. Yeah. JK, I just had to rearrange. Thank you.
you guys so much i wouldn't be doing any of this if it weren't for you i literally never thought i'd see an opportunity like this in real life it's just insane it's at the airport and i'm here with another creator let's see if you can guess who it is i'm gonna reset my whole house well i'm gonna try i'm not leaving this up till march this time um oops got a christmas tree bucket yay it's kind of sad it's all empty and cold now okay now i'm gonna vacuum gonna throw things got these really cute cloud pillows for my couch i love them and that's my living room i didn't think it was gonna take me this long i still have i could just forget this is all here next i'm decluttering and deep cleaning my room i will see you in part 5000 i'm gonna try to become that girl starting with my fridge it's giving expiration date um i'm gonna take everything out so i can deep clean Put most of it in the freezer because it's probably gonna take me a few hours pretty sure i can take the shelves out clean now it's time to fill it back up i got an egg container i feel so fancy this is so extra okay in this container i'm doing strawberries and raspberries this one will have blackberries and blueberries this is so pretty am i on pinterest i can eat a whole bag of cherries in one day so it's getting its own container so i can use it as a plate and grappas these are going on the middle shelf i cut up some watermelon so i'm putting it in this container same thing with pineapple this one's gonna have cut up vegetables to snack on crisper container thing i don't really know what it does but i'm putting my greens in it oh my gosh i didn't realize it was gonna take this much work to become that girl this is just the fridge like i wasn't ready look how aesthetically pleasing this is wow <laughs> whose fridge is this not mine it's that girl's so beautiful now i'm gonna put the juices in separate i'm just kidding <laughs> i'm not doing that putting the cheese and butter here coffee and cream are going to shelf this stuff is so good by the way it tastes like a banana milkshake sauces capri suns will go here because i'm addicted almost done after six hours this is what it looks like and i love it so much this is my favorite part there's so much space it looks like i need to go grocery shopping but i don't next step redecorating my bed part two i got different color tape for all the boxes this room's gonna be pink and i've already done that side so i just need this one i have a feeling i'm gonna be here till 3 a.m oh well first we're done this is kind of sad but i can't wait to set everything up in the new place i'm putting all the loose lip glosses in this container i'm so proud of myself i got rid of a lot of palettes i don't use these are mine and i kept a pile for my sister one day I'll wash my maker brushes, but for now I'm throwing them in here. Okay, I'm almost done. I just need the workout drawer. Do I just skip this and start my pantry? Yes, no, yes, no. See you in part three. Part three, I wish I could scream. I'm so excited. Finally gonna decorate and restock everything, starting with my DIY bath cart. For the first shelf, I'm filling two jars with lavender and eucalyptus foaming bath. Next shelf is gonna hold bath flowers, and I'm putting them in these cute little jars. Also, I put sugar cubes in this jar, and that's going in the middle. Last shelf is holding cow print face masks, way bath bombs, and then this. I thought they were fake roses, but it's actually soap. <laughs> Couldn't find cloud-shaped bath mats, so I'm going to make my own. I can do this. I just cut it in half. Now I have to make those two look like that. Oof, ta-da. Now I'm going to wash them and see what happens. How does that work? I thought it was going to fall apart in the washer, but it didn't. Oh, normal house, and then bam, portal. Last thing I have to do is restock my shower shelves, normal shelves, and my drawers. I'll see you in part four. And no, it won't take three days to stop. Yo, whatever. I'm going to make a last-minute gift basket. Courtney's almost here. <laughs> also, I lost a nail. I have to hurry on this box and i'm filling it with this this is so cute matching pen eye mask lip mask this stuff is so good it's like liquid chapstick these are our favorite sponges so i'm grabbing two. Oh my gosh that's cute next snacks look what i found birthday cake is oh hey i'm back and i got a few extra things fluff this up book is gonna go here it's the next day um i also got starbucks so i had to figure out how to carry everything upstairs this is so cute thank you to resetting my room I'm actually proud of myself it's been worse i'm gonna start with the obvious issue well at least i can see my floor now i'm gonna clear off the nightstands now this is my favorite part ew now i'm gonna clear off my bed and put some new sheets on almost done now i'm putting everything back um i forgot about the floor this is so bad Next step, decluttering and redecorating my dump site. I mean, my bath. Oh, I need that. <laughs> what? Hey, have you even seen the deals on Amazon? They're so good. I gotta pack, I gotta pack it for the sunshine. Not anymore, pack. Walking it out. Amazon plus seven days of deals? Hmm. I'm preparing water, check. Comfy clothes and blanket, check. Cheese balls, oh yeah. Yo, what up? I'm gonna try to be that girl at Disneyland. I just had to get a bubble maker because, yeah. 
Next, get drinks and snacks. This is the confetti cake shake. It's so fruity. This is the lollipop and a piece of cake. It's really good. A cookie. Cotton candy. And the blue milk. Also, it has glitter in it. It's kind of cute. Space soda. Carne asada fries. Not cute, but really good. Popcorn. Next shopping, I need to find the Starbucks cup. Oh my gosh. Ice chai is so good. This is cute. Eat this and this. Can't decide. I think I'm gonna go with Snow White. Yeah. Two of these. Popcorn. These are all gifts, by the way. I forgot to mention. I'm trying to convince myself not to get these. Mint julep. A beignet. I wrote a bunch of rides, but I forgot to film it. <laughs> Part two, now I'm gonna unpack and organize the hotel room starting with the shower. The shelf so nice. First shampoo and conditioner. Body wash. Brought some sugar scrub. Hair mask, cause why not? Razor and shave cream. Lastly, my silicone loofah. Now I'm gonna organize the sink. Face towels and makeup erasers will go here. Skincare is going on the side too. Next, oral care like toothbrush, toothpaste, and mouthwash. Putting this nail brush right here, makeup right here, and my hair stuff is going right here. I'm actually putting all the makeup removing stuff down. Here. Body care like lotion and sunscreen is going right here. Last time I slept was the day before yesterday. <laughs> I'm so tired. We're gonna pretend that looks good. Next, I put all my clothes in here. These are all my Coachella outfits, and I don't even want to show you out there because it's so bad, and I don't feel like unpacking it, so. I got a package from TikTok. It says refrigerate upon arrival, but it's pretty cold, so I'm just gonna open it, and it says open immediately, so technically, I'm following instructions. Oh my god, oh my god. I think it's a cake. I think it's a freaking... I've never been sent a cake before. Oh, it's heavy. Okay, look. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Okay, what do I do? Hold on. I've never seen a cake this tall. Says the bigger the slice, the bigger the surprise. So I have a butter knife because I didn't do dishes and we're gonna cut this for now. Got one side. Let's do the other side. Okay. Here we go. Oh, so oh whoa! <gasps> what? So cool. I've never seen a cake like this in real life and it's literally in my kitchen. Wow. Cool. Thank you, TikTok. Thank you so much and happy new year. 2022 and come back. Yo, what up? So excited because I partnered with Camera for this video. As a content creator, I do everything on my own, like editing, designing my own thumbnails, making Instagram stories. Camera just makes the process so much easier. And I'm gonna show you. We're gonna make one of my Instagram stories. My favorite ones to make are when I ask you guys to help me decide on what nails to do because I'm a Pisces and I'm very indecisive. First, open up the Canva app. There's tons of things you can choose from, but we're gonna do your story because we're making an IG story. My favorite template is this one. You can edit anything on here by tapping on it. So if I wanted to do another picture, I hit replace. Okay, everything is how I wanted except the text. I think I'm gonna do a pastel purple thing that's good i love that you can do everything through the app it makes it so much easier and it's free that is literally it i spend little to no time on my thumbnails because canva makes it super easy i'm just gonna hit save now if you haven't tried canva i would highly suggest it i'm on ig now and i'm about to post i'm so excited Part two, let's stock the mini fridge. First, I'm filling the mini bottles. Pomegranate juice, I'm probably gonna spill everything. Coconut water. Last four with just water. I'm gonna put these on the bottom shelf. Now for the fruit, I'm doing raspberries and blackberries. Baby Bell cheese. Lunchables and Gogurt on the side. I found these snack containers at Target and I'm just filling them with grapes. I bought four more, so I'm just filling them with chocolate. Can't forget Capri Sun, because I'm addicted. I've never had these, so hopefully they're good. Pickle Ricks, these are the best. Found this really cool looking soda. Strawberry applesauce. And watermelon hints. Okay, this is so worth it. It's so cute. Hi guys, so I just got a package from the American Influencer Awards and kind of freaking out. This is so crazy. I was nominated for Lifestyle Influencer of the Year for 2022. I just wanted to come on here and thank you guys so much. I wouldn't be able to do any of this without you and <laughs> just freaking out. I don't even know how to like make words right now. Voting ends August 31st. You can vote every single day and I would truly appreciate your vote. I keep doing this just because I'm just so excited. I just want to jump around. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love you. Um, Link will be in my bio. I'll be in the lifestyle category. Just scroll all the way down. And don't forget to vote for all your favorite creators too. Okay, love you. Bye. Yo, what up? I'm so excited because I'm doing another giveaway. That thing is so cute. Anyways, let's pack the box. Got these bags and I filled them with all my recent favorites for makeup, skincare, and hair. Before I continue, I got you guys a Craig Picnic basket. It's so cute. I have one too. For makeup, I got you my favorite lash kit. Papaya Beauty Blender. Blueberry Buzz Lip Injection. Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm. I love anything Fenty Beauty. Hair Beauty Mascara. Favorite palette. Lash glue. For skincare, I got you this Drunk Elephant Kit, favorite Hyaluronic Acid Serum, and eye gel. Cookies and Clean Mask by Fenty Skin. I've gone through three of these already. It's so good. Super Goop Daily Moisturizer. Niacinamide Dew Drop. Totally. Cotaly. One of my favorite brands that I can't even pronounce right. That's kind of embarrassing, but this. I swear by this. If you don't have this, go buy it right now. And eye mask. Okay, the sun's going down and I'm running out of time. This is what I got you for hair. Shower stuff, hand sanitizer, these two cups, and a beach towel. And a Stony Clover Lane tote. This giveaway is being held on my Instagram. Just look for the giveaway post. But yeah, good luck, you guys. I love you. And thank you for 8 million. The sun's gone. I should probably go inside. Resetting my entire house, part six. This is so bad. Got new shelves, so first I gotta build those. Also, I just took everything down. It's so dusty. <laughs> Three days later, and the shelves are done. I get easily distracted. Now I'm putting up this rope play. I'm trying to make it look like paint trips, but it keeps falling. I'm gonna have some patching to do when I leave. I didn't do it everywhere, by the way. It just did little dots here and there. Now I'm putting lights behind the shelves in a zigzag pattern. Um, what? Hold on. Okay, it's real. Time to put all the cups back. This is gonna take me forever. I should probably dust these. Okay, so I color coded everything. <laughs> Please enjoy this ASMR by Honey Bubba Bear. The 
this is the best thing I've ever reset. It looks like a store. I could cry right now. Like, when... Next, I'm restocking the guest bathroom. Nobody's coming over, but I really want to do it. One more thing. I'm still trying to become that girl, and I can't be that girl without a body skincare routine, so let's plan one out. This is everything I'm going to use. First step, dry brushing. I always brush towards the heart, and this is the best for exfoliating. Next step, a body wash that has skincare ingredients in it, like collagen and vitamin B3 complex. My favorite is Olay's Collagen Body Wash. It always makes my skin feeling super soft and hydrated, and it smells good. Body conditioner. Time for lotion. Olay now has a matching collagen body lotion that includes all the same skincare ingredients as the body wash. Since using it, my skin is visibly firmer and more radiant and it smells amazing. There's no greasy residue, which is amazing. I just feel fresh after using it. And that's it. It's a pretty simple routine since these products already have amazing skincare ingredients in them. Oh, look how she smiles. That's so cute. Do dogs think we're cute? If we think they're cute. Whoa! delivery driver Suzanne. I think she's terrified of me. Anyway, I'll be right back. So excited! And I just can't hide! Yeah. Wow, Suzanne, you done so fast. I'm literally dreaming right now. I've been saving so much shopping off of Amazon for the holidays. If it means Suzanne is afraid of me, that's just how it's gonna be! <laughs> Yo, what up? I'm gonna use my glow spot one last time before I pack it and show you my shave routine. I'm gonna miss this so much, but the new one's gonna be a lot better. Let's do watermelon. First, I exfoliate using any tree head body scrub. This one's watermelon. It smells so good. I have really dry skin, and this scrub does the best job at removing it, so I just take some on this glove and do circle motions. And I love how glowy and soft I feel after using it. Now I'm gonna use Tree Hut's Watermelon Shave Oil. Love this one because it doesn't irritate my skin while I shave. I do like two or three pumps. I always get the closest shave, and it's really hydrating. So, I put in here. Lastly, I use the watermelon whipped shea butter. Mm -hmm. it smells so good. Super hydrating, lightweight, and not greasy, which I love. And that's it. Time to pack it up. I can't wait to show you my new glow spot. Okay, bye. Part two. I just put these up. They're a little loose, but oh well. Now I'm putting LED lights pretty much everywhere, starting with the sink and around the mirror. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna finish the ceiling. Starting on the shower now. I got these acrylic shelves from Amazon. They're so cute. Also found matching hooks. I'm putting them on this side to hold my loofah and razor. Back to the shelves. I forgot I got these. Okay, what? How is this my bathroom right now? Since my bathroom is pretty small, showering is even worse, so I bought a curved shower curtain rod. Hopefully, it'll make it feel bigger. For my shower curtain, I was going to use this cow print one, but when I put it up, it made my bathroom look so small, so instead, I'm using a clear shower curtain liner with these curtain lights. Wow, that's different. Okay, these are waterproof, by the way. It's 4 a.m., by the way. That's what it looks like with the lights off. Terrible. I like it better with the white shower curtain, but the outside is one thing. The inside is a whole experience. I have so much space now. Look at me. I'm crying at 4 a.m. because I love it so much. All I have to do now is fill with product, make a DIY bath cart, fill my drawers. I'll see you in part three. I'm still trying to become that girl, and I can't be that girl without a sick day routine, so let's plan one out. I'm going to start by setting up my nightstands. This kind of looks like a lava lake. Found this cute jar. I'm filling it with honey sticks and cough drops. Can't forget the normal water. That side's done. Now I'm going to fill my humidifier on this side. This jar is going to be for a whole bunch of random stuff, like an eye mask, hair tie, chapstick, my inhaler, moisturizer, and this hair clip. Tissue and a trash can. Now that everything is set up, I'm going to take a bath and shower. I'm just making some tea and I cut up some oranges for a snack. Okay, finally. Now I'm just gonna hang out in my room. I brought this table up for my laptop and write down video ideas. Just put this in the microwave. It's so nice. That's basically it. I don't know what else people do when they're sick, but also if you're wondering where anything is from, I put it all on my Amazon except this. This is from Urban Outfitter. Anyways, if you're feeling sick, I hope you feel better. Love. Yo, what up? I just bought my dream couch and it's on its way right now. It's white. Time to build it. Should be pretty easy. Just screw in the legs. I'm gonna set up the pieces. Not sure what I want to do. I think I'll do a U shape actually. So I found this cup today. It's really pretty. Anyway, moving on. Should I keep this on? Probably. Is this real? Just pinch myself. Ah. It's 3 a.m. and I'm decorating a couch. Hi, Kelly. What? Checkered blanket and these round pillows. That's all I have so far. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. How is this happening right now? Well, good night, guys. It's like 4 a.m. <laughs> Yo, what up? Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases, but for my new house. <laughs> it took me 17 times to say that. First is cutting board from Nordstrom. It's wavy. I've never seen a wavy cutting board. Once I clean my dump site, it's gonna go over here somewhere. This is from Etsy. It's a cloud and a cube. That's all. It makes me very happy. You can't stop looking at it. It's really cool. Next, an oil diffuser from Seasons. It's giving very much a life in the dream house. I'll figure out how to use that later. Everything else is from Amazon, so I'll just put it on my storefront. But next, I got these disco ball drink stirs. Hazel, stop looking at me. Next, I found this tray. It's also wavy. I think I'm going to use it for my kitchen sink to hold my soap and lotion. This face, it's so cute, and I'm putting tulips in them, which are also from Amazon. But anyways, they feel real. But they smell like chemical. Really bad. Hopefully that goes away. I saw this in pink, but I really like the green. I'm running out of time. I'll see you in part two of decorating my room or unpacking my filming room. I can't decide. Resetting my entire house part nine. Just kidding, I'm moving. First, I'm gonna pack my Starbucks cups. I can't wait to show you my new place. Anyways, here's my box. There may not be a good idea, but I'm taking the straws off so I can lay them in the box like that. Now I'm gonna put this paper on top. I have to hurry so I'm not here till 3 a.m. So please enjoy the safe tomorrow. Bye, honey. Boo.
I'm gonna keep the keychains in this container. That didn't work, so I put them in here. How to get a second box? Also, how do I pack the straws? Found a basket with the lid, so I'm putting them in here. I might as well put these in there too. I wrapped the glass ones in foam and I'm done. Oh my god. Yeah, so I have to pack my entire house, so I'll see you in part two. Yo, what up? I was gonna try and unpack my room. Then Glow Recipe invited me to Malibu, so I'm gonna do that instead. Oh my gosh, we're here. This is the table. Oh my god, this beautiful drink. Why do I want my house to look like this now? Guava vitamin C eye cream. Oh my god. First course looks good. Dessert is here. I'm so excited. Oh, they got really good. Gosh, the view is amazing. Now I'm gonna grab a gift bag. Super cute. Thank you, Glow Recipe. I'm home now. Broke two nails. Time to unpack my filming group. I'm tired. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. I literally suck at camping because I bring things like this, but it's fine. How is it almost 4 a.m.? I have to hurry and stock this. Next, graham crackers. Please enjoy this ASMR by Honey Papa Bear. I didn't know how else to organize the marshmallows, so I'm putting them in these Ziploc bags. Look how perfect these fit in here. Ready? I also got this. It's supposed to help you make the perfect s'more, so that's going to go on the side. Yep, that's basically it. My camping trip also just got canceled. Good thing I got a s'mores roast. Part three, finally, the pantry. I'm going to be here all night. First, I'm taking everything out and putting it on the counter. Thanks for watching. Bye. Just kidding. I don't want to do this. Okay, kind of. Now I'm going to try and find all the expired stuff. I just found a mini pie and donut maker. Also, the sun's up now. I forgot I have these. Now I'm going to check the can. There's so many crumbs. This expired in 2018. Oh my gosh, you guys. I finally did it. I'm going to go pack my glow spot. I forgot I had this. It's a cherry toilet cleaner. Anyways. crying you are see you in part four at the new place yo what up i lost the paint to my spackle so i need to get more but they're closed i'm open in six hours so instead of sleeping i'm gonna try and unpack my filming room first i'm building my makeup drawers i'm almost done with this one not bad now i'm gonna put the drawers in also it's morning now i'm gonna go get the paint i got the paint and i'm putting these on top of the boxes so i can get the edges here goes nothing i just hope i don't make a giant mess almost done i'm so excited these are so cute. I really, I was worried for a second. It turned out so cute. I can't wait to hang them up. I keep decorating my room when I wake up, but I'm so tired. Good night. So my boyfriend comes up to me and hands me this plant, white paint, and three brushes. Yes. All he says is make a video of you painting this plant, and when you're done, bring it to me. I have something for you. I mean, here we go, I guess. I'm just getting paper towels so I don't get it on the granite. I'm nervous because he doesn't do things like this. I'm just going to lay the plant like that and get this open. I'm going to make a little dot. Oh my gosh, I think that's too much. Boop. At this point, I'm just making little dots. <gasps> this is a look. I don't know why, but I manage to make a mess every time I do something. Maybe that's why he's doing this, but I'm blaming it on the sponge things because they're really hard to work with. <laughs> I'm putting this on my tripod, and in about five minutes, I'll go in with the second layer. I'm trying to look back and think, why a plant? What have I ever said that would have anything to do with a plant? A plant has five letters. I don't freaking know. I just finished the second layer. I think it looks pretty good. Um, I just realized I'm verified. What? Okay, I'm done. Here's the video. I cannot wait to see what he has for me. Unpacking my filming room part two. Now I'm going to build the makeup table. Finally got a drill, you guys. I feel very professional. Please enjoy this ASMR by Honey Bubble Bear. I'm almost done. I have a few more screws. Then I have to try and flip it upside down. Oh, is this? Oh, it's not even heavy. Okay. How am I going to get this on top of the table? This is so heavy. Oh, okay. I can't believe I did that. I'm so proud of myself. Now I'm going to screw in the light bulbs. Thank God, lost my patience. Lost my... Okay, sorry. Can't stop jumping around. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, it's like a dream. I finally start reorganizing my makeup. It's gonna take me all night. You know what? I'm going to bed. Just kidding. Just kidding again. I will see you in part three. Good night. You know what? I was going to paint my spackler, but then I forgot I was going to Vegas for JBL Fest. So, here I am. Okay, okay. I'm here. And my feet hurt so bad. Hey. restaurant called Tao and they have all the necessities. I think it's really cute. Anyways, yeah, I gotta go back. Now we're at a Doja Cat concert and look what I got. Well, now let's figure out how to get James in the suitcase. So, okay. James the suitcase. I'll see you when I get back. Grab a pot, add in two cups of sugar, and a fourth of a cup of light corn syrup. Do not mix it. You're gonna leave it like that. Set that aside and grab a cup of water. Add in some food coloring. I'm doing red because Valentine's Day is coming up. Mix it together until it's the color you want. And we're mixing. Yeah, mixing until it's dissolved. Carefully add your food coloring water to the mixture. Okay, just, just super careful. Just like that. Very slowly mix that together, maybe for like five seconds. Just like that. Now turn your stove on to medium heat. Place that on your stove. My stove is so dirty. And leave it there for five minutes. After five minutes, it'll look like this. You'll need a candy thermometer. You can get this at Target for like 10 bucks and you need to heat it to 269. After about 
every two minutes, take a damp brush. I don't have one, so I'm just using this. And go around the sides so that crystals don't form. Once it gets there, take it off the heat and let it cool to 212. Pour that into a quart-sized container or a silicone mold. Let it sit for about three to four hours. I'll see you in part two. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases, but for my new house. First, Hazel's new bed. It's a flower. It's so cute. I also got matching food bowls. You can take them off the stand, but I'm going to leave them out. This gumball machine. I don't know. A mini portal mirror. I'm going to put this on my entryway table. Balloon dog with a balloon poop. <laughs> Bought two. Checkered blanket. It's really soft and it's going on my new couch. Steven, aka Benson, in plush four. This rug from Lonely Ghost. If you're watching this, by the way, I love you. Also, everything before this rug is on Amazon. I'll link it on my storefront. This candle from Target by Tabitha Brown. It's so beautiful and it smells amazing. Urban Outfitters cutting board. Hey, getting a massive cutting board out just for one orange. So this will be good. More cloud pillows from Amazon. They're so soft. This mushroom cup, also from Urban. A bubble maker and all of that. I'm still trying to become that girl. I can't be that girl without a houseplant, so I'm gonna try and plant one. First, I have to make the pot look cute, so I'm doing blue. It looks like a sky, right? Now I'm gonna try and add clouds. What is that? Fake clouds are better. So cute, the little clouds. Okay, so now I have to put in the potting mix. I don't know what I'm doing. I can't decide on what seeds I want to plant. Do I do the mystery flowers from the Billie Eilish concert? Or do I go pro and do veggies from Coachella? JK, not a mystery. It says wildflowers. I'm supposed to soak these overnight, so I'll be I feel like an hour is good enough. I'm going to put that on top. Wish this came with instructions. I'm going to pour more potting soil on top. Just a little. Found this water bottle at Urban Outfitters, so now I'm just filling. There's a hole at the bottom, and I've just been staying. Figured that out. Uh, this is so cute. Okay, so now I'm watering it. Like, actually, it's Hazel's plant. She's still trying to become that dog. Anyways, now we wait. I don't think I did this right, but if you want an update, Instagram. Okay. Since I'm trying to become that girl, I'm going to turn Hazel into that dog. Starting with her own closet. This route is going between that and the wall. I got these clips for her bandanas. Just wait, ready? Full body mirror, like. I don't have any carpet, so she's obsessed with rugs, so I got her this one. This is going to be her dresser. It's so cute. I'm putting her backpack and collar on top. Treats behind the backpack. I had to get a good thumbnail. Her socks go in this drawer. Did you just steal one? Her bows, scarf, and hat. More collars. And pajamas. I bought this vine, and I'm trying to shape it into a bone. Okay, we're going with the heart instead. Almost done, just adding this glow bar. And now I'm going to hang up her clothes. You like it? It's so cute. Oh my gosh. She loves the rug late again let's hurry and pack my little sister's birthday gift i do a theme every year this one is neon and musical theater the first bag i got her a playbill puzzle a broadway tote bag and some broadway socks in this bag some eyeshadow palettes i found a playbill charm bracelet on amazon and this hamilton necklace it says not throwing away my shot pop it and some earrings next bag a yellow water bottle this cute yellow wallet and a note because there's something inside a yellow pop it and her favorite gum thought this would be so cute to hold her jewelry it actually goes in this bag for the last bag i got her one of these things i don't know neon wire lights to decorate her room pizza pop it and some icebreakers just for random stuff and some more random stuff she likes to practice acting at home so i thought props at her life blue for the tissue paper and then i made this card now i'm gonna go get balloons i'm back she loved everything part four i'm gonna restock and decorate my whole bathroom starting with the shower shelves first shelf is holding hair products so we have my shampoo a hair mask and scalp scrubber i'm gonna use the hook to hang this fake eucalyptus plant and this one for my razor the shelf below that is gonna hold shaving products like the shaving oil shave butter and coconut milk sugar scrubs this one smells like real orange like freshly peeled i'm i'm in love how do i only have two shelves done this one is for shower creams body oils and body masks Last one's for body washes. Yeah, day, night, and whenever I feel like I need more collagen. I don't know. Well, I feel like I'm in a dream. Also, I linked the shelves on my Amazon storefront in my bio. I'm so excited. Now I'm going to decorate the main shelf. Top one's going to hold body brushes. Skipping to the middle, this one shelf is the reason why I redid my entire bathroom. So, yeah. I found these at the container store. I'm using them for bath salts. This one's lavender, lemon, eucalyptus, and mandarin. I may or may not need a part five, but every video's been good so far, right? I'm so close. Also, it's almost 4 a.m. I'll see you in part five. Part two, I bought clay. You guys told me to get sandpaper, so I did, and it's so smooth. Finally done, now I'm just cleaning it. Tape is on, now I'm gonna paint the whole thing white. I'm only worried about the clay part. Wait, this looks so good. Do I use the clay? Yes. No. Yes. No. Should I use the clay? I need to move the mirror, so I'm gonna trace a line around it. Oh, there's no going back now. Okay, okay, the first rope is done. Now I have to shape it to the black line. If this actually works, I didn't take ceramics for nothing. Oh my gosh, okay, Kelly, okay. I'm gonna let this dry and then somehow pick it up and put it on the mirror. What color do I paint this? I was thinking this one, but no, I don't know. I'll see you in part three. Yo, what up? I'm doing a giveaway. The first prize is vacation theme. The second one is self-care. For the vacation one, I got you this Starbucks cup and water bottle. Pineapple tree hut scrub. It smells so good. This travel set. And this one, I really want one now. My favorite palette. My favorite candle. Pina colada sunscreen. Cleanser. Vacation to me it smells like this lotion, so I had to put it in. Lip injection. Liquid bronzer. Lip balm. More lip balm. Waterproof mascara. A cute makeup bag. We're twins, because I bought myself some too. Pineapple squishmallow. Lastly, a Starbucks gift card. Now I'm doing self-care. I got you this Starbucks cup and water bottle. Lavender scrub. This one's my favorite. Tatcha cleansing and hydrating kit. My favorite eye patches and eye cream. When I light this candle, I feel so motivated. It's actually scary, but that's why I love it. Face roller, Laneige lip mask, a hair mask, lotion, cleanser, and moisturizer, glow recipe mist, lip balm, and all of this. Sorry, I'm running out of time. This giveaway is being held on my Instagram. The rules to enter will be in the caption of my most recent post. Good luck.
I can explain. Question mark. Walked into Target and there they were. So I found these keychains. And the matching cups. I found the mint one. The jelly pink one. I'm actually going to use it and not put it on display. And dark green. Look how cute they all are. Also, the keychain's actually open. Look at this. I can't believe I found this one. It's the prettiest cup I have. This one reminds me of Barney, but it's really cute. Water bottle. They did such a good job. I love it so much. The swirls. I got this one because it looks like it's glowing and I thought that was cool. Found the mint puffy cup. It's so cute. And these two. I love this one because it's matte. They did so good. This is my favorite round of cups so far. I want to design a cup so bad, but I'll keep dreaming. Okay, I'm going in and I'm asking for this. Possibly this. I can't decide. This is what we're working with. Wait, it gets better. What happened? Oh my gosh. <gasps> you guys! I just got back. Ready? Can we? Round of applause, please. These are so cute. These are easily the cutest nails I've ever had. Oh my gosh, I can't stop looking at them. They're so cute. It's been about a month since Kelly has cleaned her room. Let's see what she's up to now. Eating freaking Cheetos and watching Love Island. Very productive. Oop, she's on the way to her room. Let's see if we can get her to notice it's dirty. On the count of three, yell, Kelly, clean your room. One, two, three. Kelly, clean your room. It doesn't look like she heard us. One, two, three. Kelly, clean your room. Hello? Will Kelly ever stop eating Cheetos and watching Love Island instead of cleaning her room? I guess we'll have to find out in the next episode. Trying foods I normally wouldn't start with great. Come on, to <laughs> Never thought I'd be eating a tomato like this. <laughs> Mini peppers. I hope these aren't hot. Hazel with her squeaky toy. Okay. Maybe they all taste the same and they're different colors, like Fruit Loops. Strawberry cream cheese with graham crackers. I'm excited for this one because it looks like it's going to be good and hopefully it is. Okay, here we go. For real this time, I'm right here and I'm back to posting every single day. I still haven't unpacked, so let's do that. First, I'm taking everything out and putting it in a pile. I didn't even use half this stuff, so why the f did I pack it? Mm -hmm. Now that everything is in a pile, I'm going to disinfect everything and put it in that basket. I'm almost done. I got to make another pile for the brushes because I'm washing those. Hmm, do I put it away now or watch Love Island? Forget about it and put it away later. Okay, I'm going to put it away and Hazel's going to help me. Hey! Trying to make this satisfying and it's just not working. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Wow. I'm gonna go watch these and start filming my next TikTok. Redecorating my living room part six. I found a rug. Not that one, that one. And I found everything else to finish this today. It's a gray and white rug from Ikea. I don't know how to pronounce it, so I'll just have to show you. Staying Jerem? I don't know, but it's perfect. Now I'm gonna work on the two sides. I found these at TJ Maxx. I know they're for plants, but I'm gonna use them for my lamps. Yeah! I think it looks so much better higher up. Now I can decorate in front of it. I got this at Home Goods. I'm adding this plant because it makes me feel like I'm on vacation, and that's basically the theme of this whole living room. I'm debating whether I should paint this or buy a whole separate planter. We'll see. Now I'm adding this thing, and I ordered a small blanket to put on top of this to break the colors up. That's it for the right half. I did the same thing on the left side, and I'm adding this basket for blankets. I like to roll my blankets up before I put them in. Ah, so cute! They look like gray cinnamon rolls. I can finally start decorating the TV stand. I'm leaving this over here. Everything is Love Island inspired. <laughs> I have a problem. Somebody watch it with me. I also got some fairy lights to put into each of these. I'm doing a separate reveal video this time because last time I didn't have enough time to show you my room. But at least you'll be able to see what it looks like during the day and nighttime. I will see you tomorrow. I've been wanting to buy this for so long. It's basically chalk wallpaper and I'm going to make a chalk wall. First, I'm cleaning the wall so that it sticks better. My walls are textured, so I'm using command strips to stick poster board to the wall so that it's smooth. Just like that. And I'm leaving a little gap on the side so the wallpaper has something else to stick to. I'll try my best to film me putting this on, but with my look, I'm probably going to mess it up. The start of the first side is up. Past all of the mess, you can see my clock. It's 9.05. Let's see how long this takes me. What? <laughs> it's 12.40. But... I finished, and now I'm going to take some magnetic tape. I cut nine strips, now I'm sticking them to the wall. I'm taking the same tape. The scenery is divine, by the way. And I'm cutting squares like this. Oh my gosh, these are rectangles. And I'm dabbing a little bit of crazy glue on it. And then you just lay the marker right on top. I wanted to make sure these were secure, okay? That way, I can do this. Can you imagine what it's going to look like with all of them there? Exquisite! It is now three in the morning. I talk too much and get distracted. So I'll see you in part two. 
morning because I'm going to bed. I'm going to reset my whole bathroom while I'm going to try. I'm turning it into a glow spot. First, I'm taking everything out. Okay. I'm gonna cry. I wasn't ready for this bucket. <laughs> new year, new me. Now it's time for the aesthetic part of the video. It is so echoey in here. Okay, this spray is broken. I'm trying to make this look aesthetic, but it's not working out. That took me 10 hours. That is not okay. But at least I'm done, kind of. I still have the decorate. Got a new shower head, by the way. This is not it. It's this one I'm so excited because it has mist. But anyways, this is everything I'm gonna decorate with, so I will see you in part two. Yo, what up? I'm gonna restock my entire house starting with laundry. Please enjoy this ASMR by any book there. <laughs> Next fabric softener. Laundry sanitizer. These are so cute. They're from Target, by the way. Nope, oh, I tried. Next, I'm restocking my fridge. Yo, what up? I bought Crocs for the first time, and I'm gonna try and decorate them. I'm gonna start with the white ones, but look how cute these are. I just organized all the gibbets. Now I'm putting them on this side to plan them out. First, I'm doing a lollipop and ice cream cone. Down the cherries and the seashell. Found these bubbles, and I got a few because they're so cute. And I'm gonna use this mushroom. I also had Craig the flamingo. Literally, when I saw him, I screamed. That side's done. This one's gonna have an alien. Cute jellyfish. I'm gonna put him in. I'm so excited. Put the bubble right behind Craig, and I just think that's funny. <laughs> it's not even 3 a.m. <sighs> they're so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Excuse me. I. What? Lotion. These are so cute. Even Hazel thinks so, right? Yo, what up? I'm gonna make a Disney gift basket and give it to someone random. I'm gonna put everything in a backpack, but I can't decide this one or that one. Now I'm trying to find the donut ears. It took me an hour, but I found them. Now let's go to Starbucks. Okay, the line's way too long. I'm gonna get this hat. So cute. Lollipop. Beach towel. Why not? Now I'm gonna pick out some pins, you know, start someone's collection. Little Mermaid. Also, there's a duck. Ricky. Star Wars. Mystery pin set. Favorite one of the castle. Look how cute. Little Mermaid. Hand sanitizers. Oh my gosh. They're so cute. I'm gonna get one for me too. Also, I love how I'm just on this pen. Got this lanyard. Now I'm gonna fill the backpack. This view right here is so aesthetic. Oh my I need to find someone to go give this to. Hi! Um, so I'm filming a TikTok where I just made this gift basket and I'm giving it to someone random. So I'm just going to give this to you. That worked out perfect. She was actually a fan. So that was great. I literally love you if you're watching this. Okay. My vision board for last year really said, Kelly, dreams do come true. So I'm going to make a new one for this year. First, I'm going to organize all the pictures and then figure out the layout. I made piles. These are quotes I need to cut up. Home goals, LOL. Being more productive, eating healthy, brands I want to work with, milestones, career-related stuff. This one's thick. I got too excited and skipped ahead, but three hours later, I'm almost done. Quote is by Amber Shaw. She's so inspiring. It says, don't ever let life be anything less than everything you imagined it would be. I still make a wish every time I see this number. You never know. My angel number is 111, and I wanted to piece that in here somewhere. My sister-in-law got this for me. It's so perfect. It's going right here. Always do a center quote for everything to revolve around, and it's always this one. It's already yours. Now I'm going to take down my old one. This is kind of sad. Wow. I'm so excited. I'm going to be rating my year on YouTube, so be sure to subscribe to see that mess. I'm so excited for this year. Maybe I should start some stuff, because... Let's restock my fridge as that girl. First, water. Filling two of these with cucumber. This one with limon. This is so aesthetic. Reality. You got some trash, just dump it at my house. Next, Capri Sun, Pacific Cooler. Friggin' oatmeal. Well, this is awkward. It's turning into a pantry restock. Halloween cookies, so good. Granola. Oh my God. Do you guys like that? <laughs> These are for my refresher bar. We have blueberries, raspberries, and strawberries. Cute container for lemons. I know this is not food, but I might as well. Could go on and pretend this is all I have to restock, but there's so much more. <laughs> Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases, literally just wearing them on my feet. These flower things, but I don't think you understand. They go in your vent, so now my car is cute and stuff. Cow print pillow covers. These bins for, like, skincare, they're so small, I thought they were cute, you know? I finally got a sunset lamp. Expect this to be in every single video I do for the rest of my life, thank you. So everything I just showed you is on my Amazon page under 3 a.m. purchases. Also, update on the mirror, there is no update. I bought clay, though, just, I'll see you in part. I'm still trying to become that girl. My style is next, but first I'm going to make an aesthetic clothing rack. Blah, I can't talk today. Okay, I'm almost done. I just need this side, but what are those extra screws for? These are so cute. I found them on Walmart's website at 3 a.m. They're LED signs, but I'm going to use them as hangers. I'm also going to use normal ones in white. Wow, I love it so much. Now I'm going to add some of my favorite clothes. Just kidding. I don't have any favorite clothes. Just these shoes. And this sweatshirt I got two days ago. It's so cute. Yeah, I want to dress cute, but I don't know how to. So if you guys want to help me, comment your favorite clothing brand. Next step, I'm going to be doing some clothing try-on hauls once I get some stuff in. So yeah, wish me luck. Just in case, the rack is on my Amazon storefront. These are from Pretty Little Thing. That's from White Fox. Those hangers are from Target, and those are from Walmart. 
Yo, what up? I hope my mom doesn't see this. But it's her birthday and I'm last minute again. So what I have so far, a makeup brush holder with a lid and some makeup. Just got back from Sephora. Got her one of my favorite shampoo and conditioners. This hair mask. Mom's hair is blonde, so I also got her the purple shampoo and conditioner. This lip butter, so good. Scalp massager. Too Faced came out with this recently, so she's gonna try. It's going on a trip, so I wanna find her a makeup bag. Let's try here. If I hate going to that location, they're always so rude. What did I do? Anyways, I found a makeup bag. It's really cute. I found this mini flower bouquet. Time for the pinch and shake method. I don't know. It just always works. Okay, not bad for last minute. I think she'll like it, hopefully. Grab a pool noodle and a jump rope. Cut a piece of the jump rope off and tie it around the pool noodle like this. Take a sharpie and draw a C shape on both sides. I'll stick a gift bow on the top like that. Cut out some ears and add googly eyes. And now you know how to make. I bought a freaking cricket and I'm gonna go hide it in my brother's house because I'm an evil little sister. This is payback for the pimento cheese. I'm in his basement. I'm putting it in this ramen box. That one was this. Don't eat them. And oh, some things. Porch. Uh, I thought they were bats. I don't see nothing. I don't see anything. All I gotta say is pimento cheese. Oh, hell no. Still trying to become that girl, and I can't be that girl with dirty makeup brushes, so let's clean and organize them. I got some new makeup brush holders, and they just make sense. They have a lid. Yay, no more dust. Okay, let's go wash my nasty makeup brushes. I'm gonna use this because I can't find my baby shampoo and I'm pouring it into this bowl. It's been two hours, I'm halfway done, and I'm on the floor. <laughs> Yay, I'm done, I'm gonna let those dry. I'm gonna use my old beads because the new ones look kinda yellow. Everything is pretty much dry and I organized it by color. I'm doing smaller brushes on that side and bigger ones over here. I'm hoping I don't need a third one. Oh my, I've never, what? <laughs> these are so nice, let me close the lid. Like, whose makeup brushes are these? They're that girl's. <laughs> I'm still trying to become that girl, so I bought a gym bag. Let's fill it. I don't even go to the gym. I work out at home. That's my drawer. But oh, first a water bottle. It's my favorite color right now. A squat band. This works really well. Waist trimmer. This jump rope. Found this really cute case. In here, I'm keeping smaller things like tampons, chapstick, hair ties. It's gonna go in the front pocket. Booty bands. Sweat towel, you know. Headband that you tie. Deodorant. Hairbrush. I found another pocket, by the way. There's a side pocket, and I'm putting hand sanitizer in here. Resistance band. Ankle weights, maybe? I don't know. And AirPods. And a tripod. And a protein bar. Dry shampoo. A change of clothes. I'm just kidding. Well, actually, I don't know. Okay, I think that's the mess I make after one TikTok is... It's so bad. Let's just clean this. Scotch Bright sent me their advanced scrub dots non-scratch scrubbers, and I'm gonna see if they really work. I'm gonna put everything in the sink first. I'm just gonna... I usually hold my scrubbers awkward like this, but it's shaped like a hexagon, so it makes it way easier to hold. And it rinses clean without trapping the mess inside the sponge. Well, that was easy. It's nice I don't have to worry about my countertops because they're non-scratch. And look, it stands on its side. Now I'm finishing up the dishes. Okay, it's all clean and ready for the next mess. If you want to try them, they're available at Walmart. And if you purchase in store at Walmart through October 23rd, you'll earn points too. Just pretend I did. If you're a Latinx creator, guess what? TikTok has a new program called TikTok Latinx Creatives. It's a 10-week program to help Latinx creators take their careers to the next level, but with some of the biggest, most successful Latinx celebrities and entrepreneurs. You'll have access to mentorship, creator connections, TikTok growth strategy, and personal and professional business opportunities. You can apply from August 26th through September 8th at tiktok.com slash Latinx creatives. Spots are limited, so don't miss out. I'm actually pretty proud of myself for this one. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. It's actually 3 a.m. Anyways, I'm gonna make 3 a.m. ring pops. What? I'm doing one cup of strawberries, fourth of a cup of honey, and half a lemon. And we're blending! For the other side, I'm doing blueberries and blackberries. Imagine these dipped in tahi. Now I'm gonna freeze them. RIP to my thumbnail, by the way. Good night. Good morning. So excited. Let me try to pop one out. Oh, wow. This is how I look with the glow filter. I wanna know how to act. Okay, let's try these. Mm-hmm. Oh, so good. Imagine banana. My mom got me this box. It's kind of heavy, and I have no idea what's in it, so let's open it. I hope this isn't payback for the lip filler break. I'm so scared. If it's a bug, I will send mountains to your house. My mom has a phobia mountain. Okay. <laughs> okay, wait, wait. Gift wrap and everything. So cute. <laughs> this is a cup I've been wanting and I missed out on. Thank you. Oh my gosh. I'm pretty sure I know what the rest of these are. She got me the Cosmo and Wanda cup I've been wanting. I can't. These are all the cups I missed out on last year. They're so perfect. A black and gold one. And the red stainless steel. I'm gonna go put them on my shelf right now. Thank you, mom. I'm gonna put rhinestones on this Windex bottle. Starting with the label, I'm gonna coat it in this glue. It's been an hour and this is all I have. That took me another hour, but oh my god. Almost done. This part's pretty easy. My filming room has a lot of glass, so I've been keeping this Windex bottle on the counter. I usually hide it behind this plant, but now I can display it. <laughs> it looks so fancy. What's that? A spot on your glass. I have a lot to do today. Oh well, let's play What's Your Side. Okay. Yay. Taurus, your daughter will move out. Yikes. 
after you've ignored all the warning signs. Y'all need to fix that. Oh, this one just jumped at me. Pisces, you'll get a standing ovation. I'm a Pisces, but it will stop you from moving to LA. Interesting. Scorpio, your neighbor will show up unannounced. Could be a good thing, could be creepy, which sends you right back to therapy. What? These are juicy. Aquarius, everything will go as planned. Aww. But you still won't be satisfied. <laughs> oh my. Leo, it's time to be honest with your therapist. And it will fill a void you didn't even know existed. These are getting a little serious. Let me know if you guys like these and I'll do a part two. Okay, I got everything I need, even some glitter. I'm gonna finish putting the trash bags on the floor. I think the space is missing something, so this is gonna be good. I have this bucket, I'm just filling it with black paint. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Okay, now I'm adding in the glitter. Oh, oh my gosh, look at that. Wow, oh, it's so pretty, there's so much. Oh my gosh, I just realized something about this color combo that's really special to me. My real dad used to work at the Manly Bay Casino in Las Vegas for years, like 10 plus years. Anyway, anytime there was a large event, he would take me to the back where only employees had access to, and the floors literally look like this, and I had so many good memories there. Anyway, this is going to be a really cool thing. Oh my gosh. <gasps> okay. Oh man, this is not going to look good. <laughs> oh, maybe? I have an idea. Um, I decided on a textured piece instead. I can't wait to see it when it's dry. Part two of the mystery box, Daniela sends. There's so much in here. Again, thank you, Daniela, for sending this. We have some ring pops. She has her own shop called Candy Boulevard, so if you see any candy in here you want, you can order from the link in her bio. This is so cute. It's a bath gift set. Oh my gosh. It's, oh my gosh. Pink lemonade candy straws. Thank you. Thank you. Just thank you. Flamingo lollipops. My heart. Cinnamon discs. Oh, perfect. A sticker that says you deserve it. I don't. I really don't. It's a binder zip case. I don't have a binder, but my sister does. My voice is starting to hurt. Ketchup and mustard on a chair on a freaking bench. Strawberry sour power straws. Yay, slaps. I see these on her page all the time and I've always wanted to try them. Are these bullies? Yes, they're bullies. Helados. Well, I tried. I'm trying to learn how to speak Spanish fluently. I know I'm Colombian and I don't speak Spanish. That's a story for another time. Please explain how there's still stuff in here and it's still so heavy. Okay, part three is coming soon. Yo, what up? I got a package in the mail today. It's from Daniela. We did a swap. I have no idea what's inside here. All I know is that the theme is summer. Look how massive this box is and it's really heavy. I'm so excited. Okay, let's get this out. Oh, that's so cute. Girl, where do we even start? We'll start with this. <gasps> it's a hibiscus beach towel. Oh my god. This is my favorite flower and my favorite drink at Starbucks, the hibiscus drink. Thank you. Okay, let's open this next. This is so cute. Okay, so we have a ball. Hazel's probably going to steal that from me. A tie-dye kit. Reusable ice cubes. Oh, a Grogu pop socket. What is this? A watermelon fan. That's cute. I'm going to take out some of this. A squeezable bottle kit. Bubbles. Oh, it says bubbles. Okay, we have some stickers. Hello Kitty zip top bags. These are little dessert baggies. This is so perfect. I'm making Oreo balls for a family gathering and this is gonna work perfect. Daniela, you went insane. This box is still so heavy. I'm gonna have to do a part two, but give me like 20, 30 minutes while I film. I chose green and white this year. I think my mom is gonna freaking love it. Here's her basket. I'm gonna show you how I fill it. Basket is from HomeGoods and then I tied ribbon around it. First, I'm filling it with air pockets and paper so I can position everything nicely. Putting green and white tissue paper in the back, I'm gonna start with the taller items. I found this at Target for $5. My plan is to put it in the back as decoration. This is what I have so far. I got her a bottle and a cup with a gift card in it and her loofah set. Some more of these and I'm gonna put her onto my favorite micellar water. She don't even know. Caffeine solution thumbnail, a jade roller, coconut lime sugar scrub, this beauty pillowcase, a really cute bracelet, and some lotion. My mom hates her tweezers and she always forgets to buy them when she's out so I just got her some. <laughs> this really pretty palette and my mom's hair is dirty blonde. Isn't she gonna look so cute in this hair tie? How cute is this card? Target, run. It came out so cute. I'm also doing rose petals around the gift. <laughs> I'm hoping this helps with gift ideas in case you were looking for some. And siblings, if you're watching this, don't show this to mom. I'm going into a five below for the first time. They have makeup, clothes, so much candy. Oh my gosh. They have a party section. Look at this disco ball. This is so awkward. I was being followed majority of the time I was shopping, which was kind of fun, but awkward because that's never happened to me before. Usually they say hi and leave. I literally didn't know what to do. But if you're watching this, sorry for being awkward. They had the mini washing machine and I just had to get it. How cute is that? I got the disco ball for my IG story concerts. If you don't know about those, go to my highlights. This is what I'm most excited for.
yeah i got a yoga dice cup noodles and oreo lip balm why are these so cute makeup removing cloths squishmallows i was really bored okay oh are you serious a back scratcher keychain <laughs> and this board game yeah i don't know well this is unexpected i'm trying to make a different tiktok that i keep having to re-record because i'm trying to hide the fact that my phone case is broken so i decided to upgrade and i'm getting kissed rip that phone case and anyways i downloaded the case by app selected my phone model and the case style i wanted yep i'm doing the photo grip case with a black exterior and then i chose the grid layout can i just say this part was so fun i uploaded my photos and got to place them where i wanted it's gonna be so cute and before I knew it, my phone cases were here. I was so excited. Look at this packaging, by the way. It made me feel like it was my birthday. We got some sanitizing wipes and pulling this bow was so satisfying. They even included a mask. <gasps> okay, where's the inhaler? Now when I miss Hazel, I can just look at the bag of my phone and be sure to use my code 15 honeyboba for 15% off. I just thought of the cutest date idea for me and my dog using these floats from What Do You Mean? I'm gonna need a lot of space, so yay. <laughs> Two chairs tied a sheer with hair ties. Now I'm adding some pillows <laughs> and some blankets. Sorry. Extra mile, that's my last name. <laughs> what can I say? I'm cute. Bottom line. Four snacks, I'm doing blueberries for me. And four treats for Hazel. And we'll scooch over for Zach. What'd you say? And from the back, told you. Trust the process. Why do I shop at 3 a.m.? Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. This one's good though. Right now my collection is hidden behind these cabinets, so I got these clear floating wall shelves. A whole bunch of them so i can display them ah. i'm also putting neon lights on these it's gonna be so cute lighting is so bad in here okay so this is the wall and i already put a shelf up oh i'm so sad long story short i can't put up the rest of the shelves plan b i got this at lowe's for 30 dollars. yes but it did take me three hours to build so hopefully this works gosh it's so cute don't mind the holes in the wall i gotta patch them i'm gonna throw all my cups on here so i can get an idea of what it's gonna look like Can't wait to sort everything. I'm probably gonna color code, and my lights will be here in about a day or two. So I will see you in part two. Oh my god! I'm gonna try to become that girl, but I need cupetting to do so. So we have Tarja. White or sage green? I have a dog, and I eat in bed most weekends. Cry mascara. We're gonna go see. It. My style is next because I need help. I'm also getting this pillow because I have one on my couch and it's really comfy. White pillowcases, lunch bowls, and y'all already know. I'm taking two of these. I hate going outside. Can't be that girl without a cute candle. So we're at Home Goods. Let's see if you have psychic abilities. I think I'm gonna do two of these. I'm just kidding. I'm back. This is my situation. It's giving echo. It's giving live, laugh, love. It's giving monotone. I'm gonna paint new pictures for my room tomorrow, but for now. Hey, gleamy. Open. <coughs> white sheets, white duvet cover. Ow. I made an igloo. Now I'm throwing the pillows on and adding the butts. Look at this masterpiece. Tell me why this was at the back of the shelf. Like, we don't get enough attention as it is. Got these glow bar things from the checkout lines. Let's see if they work. Wait. What? $10 at home goods. It's so worth it. Almost done just adding a laptop. Notepads and pens because that girl is productive. Shiba Inu. Yay, I'm done. I'll figure out the wall situation later, but yay, I'm done. This is what it looks like during the day. And night. It's so cute. <laughs> like, I'm just kidding. Next step, an aesthetic nighttime routine. Yo, what up? I'm going to try to make an aesthetic hot chocolate bar. <laughs> I'm just not understanding. <laughs> Oh, I love how it's 11 at night now. First, I'm putting up LED lights. They make everything look good. I'm gonna use this laptop stand. Now I'm gonna fill the pop jars. First one's gonna have these cute marshmallow toppers. They melt into your hot chocolate. It's so good. Snowman ones too. Next, hot chocolate stirs. I didn't even know this was a thing. Also got them in spoon for hot chocolate bombs. I'm trying to make a back and forth pattern so it looks better. And these, not sure what they are, but they're really good. These are going in the back. I found Starbucks hot chocolate powder at Home Goods. Yes! And I'm gonna put them in these jars. I don't have a funnel, so I'm hoping that this works. I'm using a white chalk marker to label them. Toffee bits, crushed candy cane, and more marshmallows. What do we think? I just made it. This was a 3 a.m. purchase, but they'll be on my Amazon page. I'm adding this thing I made and some cow straws, you know. Ooh, why do I feel like crying right now? But <laughs> it's just a hot chocolate bar. It's so cute. I'm gonna take a bad girl bath. Bath boom, but it smells like banana. Some Epsom salt, and can we appreciate how aesthetic this looks? While that fills up, I'm gonna get everything I need to put on the tray. I just decided on a watermelon theme. This mask for my face, eyes, lips. I'll do this bath bomb. This is so pretty. Can't forget to hydrate. I'm using dried raspberries and blueberries. A book. Almost done, just need a candle. I almost forgot these little watermelons for your eyes. That's pretty much it. This is so aesthetic. Even the freaking water. Oh my gosh, look at the Part two, I'm gonna fill these with dried fruit. First, strawberries, bananas, raspberries, blueberries, mango, and cherries. I'm gonna put them on these shelves I got off Amazon. I'm gonna put everything on my Amazon storefront, by the way. Anyways, let's fill these. This one's gonna have crushed Oreos. This one's gonna have chocolate chips. 
you can twist these and everything comes out so easy. That's why my favorite toppings are in them. Putting the chocolate and caramel drizzle up here. Put some tea down here. Now I'm gonna put the sprinkles in rainbow order. OG approved, except that's pink. Lastly, I put these lollipops in this mushroom cup. Now let's make some soda and ice cream. This is my favorite thing I've ever made. Too bad I have to pack it up. And I have to pack my pantry because I got my keys to my new place. So yeah. Yo, what up? I'm in a hurry, but I'm going to try and decorate before I hit a million subscribers on YouTube. Starting with the cake, I'm just scraping this off. Same with this one. I didn't have time to bake a cake. Put buttercream in a bowl. Now I'm adding food color. Now I'm going to spread it on the cake. I don't know what I'm doing. Put these red sprinkles all over. I already messed up. Fine. Everything's fine. We're just going to go fast. This is so cute. Now I'm going to carefully add white glitter on top. I'm doing one more cake and it's going to have these sprinkles. Pink border. And I'm using fondant for the eyes and mouth. Can't believe I just pulled that off. These are so cute, especially this one. Anyways, it's in my mom's house. This is what we have so far. I'll be here till 3 a.m. So I brought some snacks. This one's going to have MMs. Okay. That was so loud. This one's going to have different types of chips. Now John's gonna help me put the numbers on the cake. Oh, yeah. Yeah. About to go down. I'm making a whole bunch. I hope I got enough corn syrup to fill those. First, honey, this feels so wrong. Corn syrup in Tic Tacs. Can't remember why I was pouring that into a bowl. I'm gonna store them upside down so I don't use as much. Ready? Love Island. Do you see it with the hearts? Found these white pearls. I'm pretty excited for them. Pink and purple. Light blue and dark blue. This one is a pink sanding sugar. It's so pretty. Purple. Holiday one because it's close enough. This one's my favorite. Ah! so messy they don't look edible but they're really pretty let's freeze them i heard it takes five hours let's speed that up i can't get over how pretty they are okay i'll be back i'm not ready for the mouth noises i'm probably gonna throw my phone at the wall multiple times editing this video i'm doing frozen honey first this one kind of looks like styrofoam i feel like i did something wrong it doesn't really taste like anything maybe the tic tac one will <coughs> my hair by the love island one maybe okay it's obviously not gonna taste like anything but okay oh <coughs> uh -uh. why did i think these were gonna be sweet um let me know if you want a part two trying the rest of these no excuses but what am i to do now Ta -da! i bought a mini fridge at 3 a.m <coughs> before i stock it i'm gonna decorate the outside i couldn't find a white fridge so i'm wrapping it in this vinyl now i'm cutting out these shapes and sticking them onto i don't think this is gonna look good it's kind of cute i guess <laughs> last one it's so ugly <laughs> I had a totally different image in my head. It's giving very much Yoshi is on the way to my house to retrieve some eggs. Not my intention. Next step, stocking the fridge. Part five, I'm going to hang eucalyptus onto my shower head with a hair tie. Why haven't I done this before? It looks so good. I've also never put a tray on my toilet before. It's 4 a.m. Haha, -ha. why do I do this to myself? Um, at least I have a cute bathroom. I just filled this with Lush bath bombs and I'm putting them on the shelf. I got this candle at Home Goods. It says, Cupid, you're fired. I had to get it. The last thing going on the shelf is this book. And it's random, but it's so cute. I almost forgot lotion. I'm putting that on top. I feel like I'm in my dream bathroom. Almost done. Last thing I need to do is restock my cabinets and drawers. So please enjoy this ASMR while I do that. Oh my gosh, I'm finally done. Now you know how to make a glow spa. Good night. I'm gonna make a Vat Girl Car Essentials kit. Hairbrush, hair ties, first aid kit, anti frizz hair wipes, waxing strips, you never know. Lip balm, look how cute this is. Oh my. Lotion, bobby pins, sunscreen, toothbrush, floss, and toothpaste. Wrinkle releaser, hand sanitizer, lint roller, flashlight, tahin, leg. Extra ball for hazel, and extra poop bags. Some cliff bars, a mini gorilla pod, charger, and an empty lipstick bottle with cash in it just for emergencies. A pen. And that's pretty much it. This is so bad. I'm gonna try to become that girl, but first, I need to clean and restock this. This room so let's do that i want to keep these up forever but <laughs> first i'm picking up all the trash i'm gonna make two piles for makeup and skincare yay now let's put it away Now I'm going to organize my drawers and restock. Now I'm just going to wipe everything down. Can't remember the last time I cleaned this mirror. 
disgusting up here. I'm just trying to watch Love Island and I'm over here cleaning my room. Like. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that took me all day. This weekend, I'm doing a tour of this room, so if you want to see that and help me get to 100,000 subscribers, go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, bye. Yo, what up? I'm going to try and make a giant advent calendar for my sister and niece. Wish me luck. Boxes in the middle and then bags on the side. Now that I have the layout, I'm going to decorate them and then fill them. I'm going to start with my nieces. I'm sticking these lollipop things to the back of the poster board. Okay, yes, and that's my sister's. So cute. Now I'm taking these ornaments and hanging them on the side. I wrote 1 through 12 in silver sharpie and now I'm sticking them onto the bags. I added some bows too. Oh my gosh, time to fill up. My niece loves turtles, so day one is a turtle ornament. And my sister gets a microphone because she loves to sing. Candy canes for day two. Day three, I'm doing bath bombs and a snowman. Oh my gosh. Day four, I found these wallet lanyard things, but there's an extra pouch for extra stuff. I don't day five, a beauty sponge. Day six, these candles. They smell so good. I'm gonna have to put extra tape on the bags, though. Chapstick for day seven. Found these really cute hair ties for day eight. And some makeup removing towels for day nine. I'm excited for day ten. It's gel pens. Day eleven is an Oreo house, but I'm trying to wrap it. And necklaces for day twelve. <laughs> Yo, what up? I'm excited because I'm here at my sister-in-law's work. She has no idea I'm here, by the way. I'm here because I'm dropping off a little surprise. Just something to spread a little joy to her this holiday and to say thank you. I love her so much. She truly inspires me and she always pushes me to be the best version of myself that I can be. She's so loving, caring, and giving to others. So today, I just wanted to give back to her. I have to hurry before she sees me, but Starbucks is literally in her face, so I can't wait to see her reaction. Oh my gosh. How are you? Um, I'm just here to drop off this gift for you. For me? Yes! It's just... You inspire me so much, and you're always so giving to me and just everyone around you. And I just wanted to say thank you so much. Thank for you. Me. You. You're welcome. <laughs> I just got back. Her reaction was so cute. I hope this inspires you to give back to someone, whether it's a friend, family member, or someone in your community. You never know how meaningful an act of kindness can be on a given day. I'm going to try a back row morning routine. First, I'm making my bed. Can we appreciate how aesthetic this looks by the way? Like, Time to hydrate. Now I'm brushing my teeth. I like to work out at night, but I guess this makes sense. Here we go. Oh, time to shower. This is hard. I need more time. Lotion? Why does my leg look like a corn dog? I'm filming a beauty room tour for my YouTube channel, and I'm barely going to be in the video, so I'm wearing comfy clothes. I usually don't eat breakfast. <laughs> what are you doing? I made eggs, toast, honey, and banana. Did you hear that? It sounds like that girl's about to eat her breakfast. Now I'm going to do my skincare. Wash and tone. Hyaluronic acid and eye cream. Moisturize and SPF. I'm almost out. Now I'm going to plan out my day. Yay, I did it. Next step, that girl nail. I'm going to try to become that girl, but I need an aesthetic night routine, so let's plan one out. First, hydrate. I don't have any more lemons. I'm going to make a cute snack to post to my Instagram. First, add yogurt and flatten it out. Clean the edges. Now just add some fruit and make it look cute. And granola, I like this one. I'm getting ready for my that girl shower, so I'm laying my PJs out on my bed. This stuff, so good. I always start with my hair. I use Olaplex once a week. And Moroccan oil every day. This is my favorite hair mask right now. Now I'm going to grab a clean washcloth. Body wash. It's hard to film and shower at the same time. I'm literally not even doing it. I'm going to do it after. Yep. Now I'm going to exfoliate. This stuff is so good. I feel like it works better when you use the glove. Time to shave. This is the best for getting dead skin off your feet. Body conditioner. Now I'm actually going to shower. I'll be right back. Lotion. More lotion. Double cleanse. If it's not image skincare, I'll still like it, but not as much. The scrub. It's giving Mike Wazowski, but we like that. Man. Oh my goodness, this is a lot of work. I forgot toner. We'll try again next time. Serums. So aesthetic. Finally, eye cream and moisturizer. Glossy. Let's see if I can do this with one hand. Always tap your toothbrush for good luck. My hair is basically dry. I'm going to put it up with this little scrunchie. Now I'm just getting more water. Okay, so <laughs> you didn't make it. She does this every night. Here's your ice cube. I don't have a humidifier, but I do have a book. And I'm going to watch Love Island. I'm probably not going to sleep until 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning, but I did it. Anyways, next step, an aesthetic morning routine. Part two, I'm going to try and make spackle art for the wall above my bed. Should I do this in the garage? Yes, no. Yes. Covered the couch, so it's fine, I hope. Drew up my design so I don't mess up. Now I'm supposed to mix this. Hope I don't mess this up. Okay, it's flat. It's actually really fun. Okay, now I'm going to use this to make the wave. I almost fell on this corner. I'm going to hurry and do the top now. I feel like I'm decorating a cake. Okay, this will turn white when it dries. I'm going to work on the second one now. Let's look past the dump site I just made and look how cute these are. Now I'm going to let them dry before I paint them, so yeah, I'll be right back. I'm still trying to become that girl, but I can't be that girl without a cute room. First, I gotta build this. It's 10 p.m., by the way. I'm gonna cry. Good morning, kind of fell asleep. This is what I have so far. Okay, we might have a problem. Okay, Kelly, come on. It'll be easier if I move the bed frame closer. Yeah. I hope this doesn't break the bed. Yeah! I'm putting LED lights under the bed. Now that I have a giant marshmallow, I'm gonna add the pillows. Okay, this is what I have for the room so far. So much more I need to do, like a whole other side. I also need to redo this mirror because it broke, so yeah, I'll see you in that video. 
I'm gonna try to paint these baby pumpkins. I have all the colors for each design I'm gonna do, so yeah, wish me luck. This one's gonna be cute, just wait. I don't have a blow dry. Okay, first one done. That one took forever to dry, so I'm gonna do the first layer on all of them first. This one's green, yellow, white, this one's tan, light purple, and another green. Couldn't help it. I finished the culprit one, now I'm working on this one. It has stars on it. Now I'm doing this abstract smiley face one. I don't know if it's gonna look good, but it's my favorite one. <laughs> now I'm gonna work on this one. Oh yeah, I did that. Don't know how I feel about it, but think about it. I am the only one in the universe at this exact angle at this is exact moment i'm just redoing this one I regret doing that oh my gosh don't mind that one but the rest of those like i would separate them and put them all around my house but they just belong together you know why i haven't posted in two days it's because of these so bye i'm still trying to become that girl so i'm starting a bullet journal i'm gonna decorate the outside first with these stickers i made hold on wait a minute that was so cute. I feel like I need more though. I have a really good idea for the first page. Also, I almost paid $25 for a six pack of these markers when I found this 120 pack for 36 on Amazon, please. It'll all be on my Amazon page in my BIO. Skipped a few pages for the index. I'll do that later. I've always wanted a follower tracker. I'm adding in some cow print. Not sure if it's going to look good, but gosh, I messed it up. I don't even have white out. Anyways, I hit 6.2 today. Thank you guys. So we get to fill that in together. Kind of ugly, but I'll get better. I have a lot more pages I want to fill out so I can do a part two or I can move on to the next that girl video let me know. take it all in i just woke up and i couldn't wait to make this video i went to sephora and i got a wet wax i'm trying it for the first time hopefully it can help my hair i've been straightening my hair every day since seventh grade so yeah also faith four sent me this whole goodie box i'm gonna be trying their one minute mask got the shampoo conditioner my ends feel so soft now the mask i don't use that much it smells like vacation ah! It feels kind of dry, not gonna lie. I'm gonna trust the process. So I'm gonna use this Smooth For Sure Blowout Cream. It's supposed to be a heat protectant as well, so I'm gonna let it finish air drying and then I'm gonna style it. Okay, my hair is dry and it's so soft, I was worried for a second. To straighten my hair, I use the Silk Elements Heat Spray and then the Wet to Straight Straightener from Walmart. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. I'm gonna use Texture Spray and Shine Spray by Air. <gasps> okay, wow. Part four, this is really heavy. Feels like my birthday. Ah! These look so yummy. Glitter flip-flops and they're my size. Oh, this is so cute. What is this? What are you? Ah! Ah! It's donut chalk, please. It's donut chalk. I'm trying to go as fast as I can. I should probably stop talking. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes! This is all of my favorite candies, Daniela, thank you. Hello. What time is it? This is taking me two hours. <laughs> makeup storage. This is perfect. I have a lot of makeup I need to organize. I'm just gonna take out the big one. Oh my gosh, wow, this is so cute. Dude, dude, this is so sweet. I'm drinking my water like this from now on, by the way. We have some more stickers. This is heavy. Icebreakers and jelly bellies. There's so much, I'm just gonna dump it all. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna do one last part, part five, because the rest deserves a video on its own. I'm still trying to become that girl, and I can't be that girl without an aesthetic mirror, so I'm gonna paint mine. First, I'm taping it. It's supposed to look like a portal, so I'm doing three sections. First section will be pale blue. It's not going back now. Okay, that's cute. That's actually cute. Wait, yeah, next dark blue. I'm gonna try to aesthetically paint this for you guys. It's not working out. I give up. No, I don't. Now I'm peeling the tape off. Um, I don't think I did this right. It's peeling off because I didn't prep it right. What about a nice ombre? I'm gonna peel all the paint off and try this again. Maybe not the same design. Can't wait to see you in part two. And yes, it is 3 a.m. I'm gonna try to make an aesthetic wreath or just a wreath. What is this even called? I don't even- anyway, so first I need to figure out how to get it on- like stuck onto here. Just finished tying the gorland around the middle part. Now I need to do the outside. Now I'm gonna spray it with fake snow. <gasps> I'm actually gonna put the pine cones on first. Okay, just trust the process. I'm gonna- Now I'm gonna put the ornaments on. I went with gray, clear, and gray. Bought a bunch of hooks for nothing. It's so much easier to just tie them onto the pine needle thing. <laughs> okay, let's hang it up. It's not even for my front door. It is for my room. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love it. So you walk in. Bam. Like. Part three, it's dry. I'm gonna sand the edges so it's more smooth. First side's done. This is the only sandpaper I have left. So it's not gonna be the smoothest, but oh well. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna try and paint this now. I decided on pale blue with a glow and dark layer on top. Just got done with the last layer. Now I'm gonna turn off the lights and we're gonna see what it looks like. Okay. Why does that creep me out? No, thank you. Now I have to figure out how to get this onto the baby. I can just slide it on. Oh my gosh, I did. <laughs> I'm gluing it together with this, but there's a problem. Not all the edges lay flat. Oops, I'm putting weights on them. Here it is. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Oh my god. It's perfect. Don't mind the mess in the background, but oh my god. 
deep cleaning my nail cart because it's so bad right now. I'm just gonna start by taking everything off the cart. Wow, okay, the first shelf is done. Let's see how long this takes me. It's about one o'clock right now. The second shelf is done. Oh my gosh. Wow, now I'm just gonna wipe it down with the Lysol with hydrogen peroxide. This smells so good. Ew, there's so much dust. I took everything out of the bins. Now I'm gonna disinfect them with barbicide wipes. My setup is pretty much staying the same. I'm putting my most used products up top. I'm still keeping my nail tips and dual forms on this side. Wow! I forgot to mention, I wiped all the little stuff with Barbicide, too. I'm finally on the last shelf, and it's 3 o'clock. Are you ready? Bam! Oh. My. God. Woo. Usually I can explain. This time I can't. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Look how cute this is. I can't. I cannot. It comes apart just like the real cut. Just like the real cut. I got two of the icy white sets because I'm planning a giveaway. I found this dark green gridded cup. It reminds me of grass. Okay. I'm just gonna go quick. I had to get two just in case one broke. Everyone's calling this one the jeweled cup. I got it in peach and dark green. Pink and black and green water bottle. Dark green stainless steel. This is a color changing cup. I'm not sure what color it changes into, but both of them. I couldn't find this one in a venti, so I went with grande. Stainless steel one. As you turn it, it changes colors. Same with this one and the straw. I try not to get grandes, but this one reminded me of candy cane. Never seen one like this before. This one is a mixture of those two put together. What? Running out of time. Those two. Looks bad and a mess, but it's a sorted mess. So this is my pile, which is probably really bad. But this is for gifts and some giveaways I'm planning. Wow! Starbucks, congratulations on 50 years. And cheers to many more. They also gave me this really cute gift box that I will be keeping for the rest of my life. Um, let's open it. It did come with this cup. A note with a gift card in it. Medium roast coffee beans. And a hot cup. It's so cute. Thank you, Starbucks, and happy 50 years. I'm going apple picking with my family. So let's get ready for it. First, Starbucks. Instead of my usual refresher, I'm going to try the apple crisp macchiato. That's good. Here's my apple basket. I'm gonna bring a picnic blanket, some water, snacks, and some hand wipes I just put in this. Almost forgot a portable charger. We're gonna be taking lots of pictures and videos. Okay, I think I'm ready. I'm so excited. We are out here and it is beautiful. It's so cold and I lost a nail, RIP, but I got apples so it's all good. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. It seemed like a good idea at the time. You can do it with any fruit. I'm using a watermelon. <laughs> First you screw these into the bottom to make it stand. But you're supposed to cut the top off. Scoop all of the fruit out into a bowl. And we're blending! I just put the tap in. Now I'm straining out all the chunks and seeds. Oh my gosh, let me put some ice in and let's try it. Yes! Yes, this is what shopping at 3 a.m. is all about. It leaks a few drops after you've used it, but other than that, I have no regrets. I'm gonna recommend this on my Amazon page because it's so stinking cute. In case you want to try it, the link is in my bio. This is a test because I posted a TikTok two hours ago and it has zero views, zero anything. And I think it's kind of weird because I usually get at least one view, you know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, uh, let me know if you see this. Yo, what up? I'm trying this again. This time I'm doing a Halloween theme. I'm putting tape around the edges so the glitter doesn't go everywhere. I'm going to try and do a green and black ombre, so wish me luck. First layer done, now I'm mixing green and black. I'm on the last layer. This looks so cool. I just discovered something, so if you go like this... It makes these little swirls. Oh my god. I want to seal them at the same time, so I'm working on the orange one now. I'm so excited. To seal the hole, I'm using cabinet bumpers. I have my nail lamp. Now I'm pouring UV resin on the top, like that kind. It says to leave it on for 60 seconds, so I'm just going to lay it on the top like that and kind of balance it. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. They're so cute. Part two of the mystery box, we got a whole bunch of Lush. This smells so citrusy, I love it. This is the Twilight bath bomb. A comforter bath bomb. Don't want TikTok to take the video down, so that's what this one is called. I think the flower, like, pops up when you put it in the water. Okay, I've got my video taken down for making brownies. Like, I can see where that's, like, questionable, but still. Look how cute this fanny pack is. We got some gummy bears. I love to put tahine and chamoy on these. Nutella, baby! I love Nutella! More dark chocolate, and it's pomegranate flavored. Some Oreos. What? Most stuffed? These exist? Oh my gosh. When I was little, I would take out the stuffing, put it in a Ziploc bag, and give the cookies to my siblings and eat the stuffing. Next, we have some pins. I'm all that in dim so That's so cute. A gummy burger? What? And this headband, it's so soft. Miles, thank you so, so much for everything. I'm gonna go run a bath right now and put on my eye mask. Yo, what up? Got a package in the mail from Courtney. It's only open because I had to rip off her address. This is a swap and I have no idea what's in here. The only thing I do know is that our theme was pink, so whatever's in here is pink. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's a note! This is so cute. I'm just thinking about the note I gave you. It's not as cute. <laughs> 
my gosh. I don't even know where to start. I'm probably gonna say cute a lot. Oh, this is so soft. Yes, my favorite lip oil. A surprise ball. Let me open it real quick. You're supposed to unwind it and I got this little fortune. Yeah. Oh my god, this is actually really fun. So far, I've gotten a tattoo and this pocket crystal ball. Nice. Next, we have some Oreos. <gasps> yes! Thank goodness. I've been eating some of these. Truffles. I've never had this flavor. Ooh, there's something inside. This is so cute. They're erasers. I'm taking some of this out. Crayon lip smackers. This mask is so cute. This is everything so far. The box is still really heavy. I'm running out of time, so part two will be up in like five minutes. Grab a bowl. You'll need one cup of cornmeal. I'm using bun. One cup of mozzarella. A little bit of salt. I'm just eyeing it. Set that aside and grab a pot. You can either do a cup of milk or a cup of water. My mom's probably watching this like, girl! While that's warming up, let's open the griddle I just bought for this recipe. The milk is ready. Now pour it into your bowl. Um, don't pour in the milk all at once like I just did. While it's still warm, add in some butter. You don't even have to use a griddle. I just bought one because that's what my mom uses. And you just kind of go like this. Okay, mom, I got this. I have my stick of butter. Putting it in my hand to like lotion. Take a little bit of this. I don't have gloves. I only have Ziploc bags. When it's in a ball like this, you kind of go like this. Transfer it to flatten it out. And then you hit the edges like that. <laughs> Technique. Keep checking on them and flip them once the bottom goes brown. Now you know how I attempted to make arepas for my Colombian family. It's almost 1 a.m. I'm going to see if my mom's awake to get a reaction. I'll see you in part two. I got the cardboard game, so let's just see how this goes. I chose random dare cards and wrote them down. I'm scared. Oh, no. Read your Google server <laughs> no. My mom swears a UFO passed her house last night, and I was trying to make sense of the picture she was showing me, and I still can't. That was embarrassing. Take an ugly selfie and let the group meme it. Okay, here's the picture. I know, so cute. And yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Call blank and whisper the whole time you're on the phone. another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Actually, I woke up at 3 to get to my Starbucks at 5 a.m. I went a little crazy, but it's for the cup collection, so it's fine. The first one I got was this rainbow dome lid. Look at the straw. That's so cute. People are saying this was the pride cup. It's so pretty. Look at the top of this water bottle. They match. And then I got this one. Ah, it's like emerald, right? This is emerald. This one is so... the only one on the shelf and i was first in line you should have seen me i was like Whoa. this reminds me of someone named Flo. that's what we call hazel when she smiles see doesn't she look like a Flo? this one is my favorite one same one but different color i got a stainless steel one i don't know i think i did a pretty good job at finding everything now it's time to put it away these were too tall so i had to take the straws out i need to find a better way to display these because i want to see them all but for now i'm obsessed Yay! I'm excited for this one. Everything I'm going to show you is on my Amazon page. If it's not, I will let you know where I got it from, but the link is in my bio. I'm so low on everything right now. I haven't done lashes in a few months because my focus is somewhere else, but I think I got this container at Bed Bath Beyond or Home Goods. Up here I have micro and lip applicators. I use these for so many things like adding pre-treatment or sealant or even removing the lashes. Here I keep my under iPads. I've tried so many. These are the best ones I've found so far. For any service before I set up, I like to lay a dental bib down and then put my stuff on top, and I just keep them on that bottom drawer. Spoolies, cotton swabs, and tape. If you're willing to spend a little bit more on tape, next care is so much easier to remove. Oh my gosh. And it's more comfortable for your client. I get my tiles from Home Depot. I thought these ones were so cute. I got this at Michael's. When I make my pre-made fans, I just store them in here. My Nano Mister. It's so cute. Lash shampoo that I love. This manual air blower. Honestly, I just use this fan. I know I should try other lash brands, but I just love Minky's lashes. When I practice, I keep the tiles in photo boxes. These magnifying glasses come with a light. Super helpful. If I missed anything, I'll list it in the comments. I'm freaking out. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. Some of you may know I work at a call center. I quit my freaking job. I quit my freaking job. I'm unemployed. Here's my equipment. I'm about to turn it in. I'm going to put these on one last time. I quit my job. I know. I'm going to do my call center voice one last time. <clears throat> Hi, thank you for calling blah blah blah. My name is Kelly. Who do I have the pleasure of speaking with today? What's that? You're being rude for no reason? And you're attacking me personally? Blah 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 blah. In all seriousness, this is probably one of the best jobs I've ever had. I made so many good friends. If you're watching this, by the way, I'm gonna miss you so much and good luck because some of those customers are just bad, just crazy. Oh my God, like, all I've ever known was working for somebody. Like, I did not think in a million years I'd be able to, like, work for myself and have, like, the biggest support system. Hold on. Let me compose myself. Uh, hi, I'm Kelly.
Kelly and I work social media full time now. This is all because of you, so thank you so much for making my dreams come true. Part three of the mystery box Daniela sent. She took the time to wrap and put stickers on this. It's so cute. A freaking glitter beach ball. Hold up. Oh, the glitter moves. Oh my god. Next is this. We have some nail files. This cute scrunchie. This is a scrunchie with tails. That's so cute. And some hair ties. I actually really needed these. I'm gonna go for this one. Oh, cute. It has the Candy Boulevard sticker on it. Thank you for taking the time to wrap these. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, no way. This is way more than I expected. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. No, I'm just cutting onions in the background. A magic towel. My sister would love this. A pineapple keychain. What is this? Oh, okay. It's like a roll-on aroma thingy. That smells amazing. Some Listerine pocket packs. A cranberry hand sanitizer. And a transparent case that has Mickey Mouse on it. Some sour belts. <gasps> more sour belts from Candy Boulevard. Yay! I think I'll be able to finish this in part four. I'll see you soon. Part two, the LED lights have arrived. I was like... Why are you so obsessed with me? I'm putting all of the cups on this table because I gotta flip that upside down. Just kidding. I'm just gonna put them behind these two things. Okay, I'm at the bottom of the other side. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Now I have to figure out, do I color code? Do I go by type? Okay, but where does this one go? Blue, green, or pink, purple? Because of the red. It's gonna have its own section. This one can go anywhere, but I'm gonna put it here because that looks good. Now I'm switching up where they are. I'm doing black on top, then blue pink and purple as i get more cups i think the last two shelves will look a lot better oh my gosh guys it's so pretty oh my god i don't know what that was but oh my gosh ta-da it looks so good oh my god oh my this is just casually in my living room this is off this is on you know what song is playing in my head right now <laughs> i went shopping for one thing and came home with so much more haul so this is the reason i left my house mouthwash it's really cool I gotta fix that. Got the 35G palette by Morphe. It's so pretty. And the Morphe 2 concealer. Also, if you want to support me next time you shop at Morphe, use code GLAMFAM1650 for $5 off your next $10 or more purchase. Wow, that's pretty. I got a makeup sponge. Kylie did a restock on her birthday lip balm, so I had to get those. I will be repurchasing this set just for these three. They smell amazing. My favorite is a watermelon. And then these? This one just smells like old, like my grandma's house. It's not a bad smell. It just, I don't know how else to describe that. And then this one? Imagine leaving a peach on your counter and leaving for vacation for one month and coming back and taking a whiff. That's better than sex mascara because I'm always running out. A watermelon sugar scrub. I'm addicted to these. This necklace with a K on it for my name. anti frizz hair wipes. Shave cream and peel off mask. I heard they were really good. This lotion, super thin. That's why I like it. And here's everything else because I'm out of time. Yo, what up? I just got back from a hiking trip. I'm feeling fit. Not the point. I have to unwrap. <laughs> unwrap. Unpack all of my stuff. But first, I'm opening a box that TikTok sent me. I always feel so appreciated. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. As you can see, I'm opening it a little late. Oops. But I have forever florals. Oh my god. Oh my god. Aww, so cute. It says they last up two years, so I'm keeping them on my vanity. A mirror and a pop socket. Hey, I love it. It's so perfect. So you pull a card and follow what it says, and this really means a lot to me. Like, look at the kind of cards that they have. Each night before bed, remind yourself of something great you did today. Like, this is so nice, and there's so many more of those. Again, thank you, TikTok, and to everyone who put this kit together. You did amazing. Do you guys want to know how ridiculous I pack? Let me know, and we'll unpack it together. I thought I was quick. No, I could not find the gold cups anywhere, but I did get some cute ones, and I want to make a cup collection shelf now. Honestly, I'm just grateful I was able to get this one. <laughs> Our ice machine has been broken, so we've been getting pebbled ice from the gas station. Imagine pebbled ice in here. Ah, look at them together. I'm going to start by taking everything out. Oh my gosh, they're so cute together. I've never had them all in one place at the same time. I'm going to clean the shelves before I put them on. I should do it this in a year to see how many I've collected. I'm using these two for now. The random cups are going on the top part. I'm a huge fan of Love Island, so I got the cup and I use it every day. I don't even know why I'm putting it away because I'm going to use it, but the drama on the show is so good. Anyway, that's the first shelf. My Starbucks cups are going on the bottom. These two are staying together, though. I just don't have the heart to separate them. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys are witnessing the start of my Starbucks cup collection. Bye so excited it's finally full my mom and i wait all year long just to redecorate for it together and I'm going over today and i thought it'd be super cute to surprise her with a fall gift basket and some starbucks to get her in the mood he's all want to see grandma i got us pumpkin spice lattes because that's our favorite here's the gift basket i got her a gift card so she's all set on pumpkin spice lattes and bath bombs caramel popcorn this cute starbucks cup and a little toy for her puppies are you excited to decorate mm-hmm getting my nails done these are them right now so cute guys all year in love year in love year in I think I'm gonna do a mixture of this one and this one. 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> they're so cute. Like, they're so cute. They're pretty girly, but I am okay with that. They're so cute. Deep cleaning and redecorating my living room part two. All of this mess and this needs to be moved out. I'm going to start with the storage cubes. Oh gosh, what is in here? Gosh, I think this is my stepdad's, but my brother and I would play it all the time. See, that stands for Andrew and Kelly. Can you tell I love card games? It's so cute. It's all sorted. Now I'm going to clear off the table. This was my little call center desk, and it's still so weird not seeing a computer on it. Yikes, I'm glad I'm cleaning this. This does not work anymore. I'll be using this in a different room. It totally looks like I just moved in. And there's even an echo. Coco! I have five boxes of stuff I need to build to fill this area, and I can't even bring them in because they're so heavy. I'm going to be honest, it's probably going to take me all day to build them, so I will see you at 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning for part three. <gasps> You're still here. Okay, you get a little sneak peek of some more things I bought for decorations, and don't, don't mind me. It's one of those days. I'm really proud of this one. So I found one of these knitted ball seat things, and I found it for 30 bucks at Home Goods. What? I saw this and I just had to buy it. It's so cute, but I'm actually going to repaint it. Another plant. Why not? This basket is so cute. It's from Target and I'm going to use it for my blankets. But I'm spray painting a different color. I'm addicted, y'all. I'm tired of seeing it and being the only person who hasn't tried it. At least that's what I feel like. Well, we'll see what's about to happen next, okay? I have my fruit. What's the strategy? Lizzo had pomegranates in hers, and I could not find them anywhere, so I just made my own. I'm doing strawberries, raspberries, blackberries, and blueberries. I'm so excited. Time for the cocoa water. I don't really like coconut water, so this is going to be interesting. Can't forget the ice. Okay, here we go. It's just how it looks. <laughs> but what if? We add a splash of almond milk. Let's try it. I don't know. I just wanted to try it. Don't do that. No, but honestly, I think my life has changed. I could literally eat this every morning. Part two of the mystery box. I'm taking more of this out. Thank you, Courtney. I needed this. My lips are always so crusty. Ooh, some mascara. Oh, yes, I'm using this tonight. An eye mask. Is this is so cute! Some jelly bellies. Glitter pens. These are really cool. Another eraser thing. A baby bottle pop. I haven't had these in forever. It's my birthday week, so this is like opening a birthday gift. Oh, a pink chocolate bear. Why was I wrong? This is actually an eyeshadow palette by Revolution. It's so adorable! Some more candy. Strawberry chapstick. Another eyeshadow palette, and it's squishy. What? I found these hearts, and they're full of really cute erasers. A pink tumbler. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. It's a matte pink mug. Another makeup palette, but this one's shaped like a burger. I gotta open it. Are you kidding me? This is now my favorite thing in my makeup collection. Courtney! This is so cute. Thank you. We said a budget of 50 bucks, and this is definitely more than that. Thank you so much. And I, yikes, I hope you like what I got you. Yo, what up? The living room is finally done. I can finally do a reveal, kind of. There's still some things I want to do. Look at Hazel, she's so cute. I don't know what she's doing right now. Oh my gosh. Let's see how many times she does this. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't think she's gonna stop. You getting tired? Ooh. I still want to do something with the bottom of this plant and hide some cables, but other than that, it's pretty much done. The light, the Shiba Inu, everything just looks so perfect. I feel like I have no energy. I fell asleep at like four in the morning and I'm just so tired. I didn't do anything else with the couch. It's still the same and so is the mess, but it's cute. It's fine. The vacuum lines on this rug. I would show myself using the couch, but I look like a horse stomped on me and left me to die. My brother left a fake cockroach in my drawer. I was planning on moving it, but now that I'm moving it, as if you're my brother, I'm coming for you. I might be right behind you. I'm too scared. Put paper towels on top of it so I wouldn't have to look at it. Double-sided tape on the Swiffer. I don't want to touch anything that's touching it. Just that's the Swiffer. I'm not touching that. I don't think I can do this. Genuinely, I don't think I can do this. Kelly, come on. Pick it up and pretend it's not there. Pretend I don't see it. I'm gonna throw the whole thing away. Okay. Got it. I've been scaring Kelly all afternoon with this fake roach in her room. <laughs> She's downstairs, not even paying attention. Went ahead and I planted this little roach. Right here. Hopefully, she comes in here to do her next video. She will come across that thing and freak out. Payback for the for the cricket. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Well, a few. A honey pot plush. Now I have <laughs> honey boba bear. This. I'm just kidding. Um. 
this stuff though like oh i'm spraying sour spray on my face and then this really wait i should have made a three minute video water bottle drying rack and it holds strong okay so like you have a cutie right and then you just go like this with the little ring thing and it's just easier to open. i get really motivated at 3 a.m so i bought a shelf basically when i buy something for a video or a company sends me product for a video instead of throwing it around my room on the floor or just random places i will organize it on here <laughs> <laughs> two days left it's fine everything's fine let's put up the tree what do you think it's giving my life right now i'm kidding i'm so i'm gonna try to make a cloud themed tree so these are the raindrops you know now i'm gonna stick this white garland around the tree and the white ornaments are mini clouds i actually got a tree topper this year okay, whoa i didn't know it did that wow that's really cool i had to turn my flash on because the lighting is so bad but now i'm adding this white fluffy tree skirt the last thing i need is hazel's paw print one paw at a time this was hers last year they're the same <laughs> but it's fine dark so quick but this is what it looks like at night time oh my gosh it's so cute next step i'm gonna try and wrap gifts as that girl so i moved back into my room so part three of the mirror will be up soon this is the aftermath of a thanksgiving dinner it's time for a reset i'm gonna start by cleaning and organizing my kitchen everything is off my counters and now i can deep clean i'm going in with scotch brights one step disinfectant and clean this is literally all i use to clean now because it's so convenient it's a five-in-one solution that cleans disinfects sanitizes deodorizes and decreases all in just this one bottle i wish you could feel my counters right now because Hear me out, okay? I can either do dishes now or pretend they don't exist for the next few weeks. Final. I like to use Scotch Bright's Advanced Scrub Dots Non Scratch Scrubbers because they have three times the scrubbing power. I also use it to clean in and around my sink, but I love how it rinses clean without trapping any mess inside the sponge and it resists odors, and it's cute. Now I'm gonna put everything back and add some cute decorations. Okay, yes, it's giving. Also, if you want to try Scotch Bright's One Step or the Advanced Scrub Dots, you can find them on my Amazon page or at Walmart. Let's open some PR. If you want to know why I was gone, check my IG stories later. Maybe I might post a story time. You guys. First, we have Morphe. Thank you. We have the Cherry Cup collection. Look at that blush. It actually smells like cherries. And look at the palette. It's so beautiful. I'm definitely going to be using these colors. And we got a lip gloss. You can use my code for money off. Next, Ofra. There's so much in here. Oh my god. I'm crying. Thank you so, so much. I did not expect all of this. Um, I've never used Ofra cosmetics before. They're vegan and cruelty free. So I'm super excited to try them. They even sent me some skincare. Hold on. Get some swatches. The lip are super buttery and they smell amazing and the pigment on the eyeshadows are unreal they're so beautiful dw home sent me some candles and this is how i know they pay attention i use this room sprite everywhere it's in the back of my videos all the time and they sent me it in candle form that's all that all smells so good thank you so much i'm totally sharing this with my mom this one came at the perfect time mccart sent me their brand new poly gel collection i can't wait to use it thank you i'm so grateful for everything let me know if you guys want a part two y'all i hope my mom doesn't see this but her birthday dinner is in an hour and i forgot to get her a gift let's go do that i did make this cup for her so i'm gonna base the gift off of this how do this gift card maybe i'll stick it in the cup she did say she needed more straws some snackies okay let's go to target this one and this tissue paper or that one i think i'm gonna go with this one Okay, I think I found the one. I'm back. Look how cute this is. Okay, I have 20 minutes. Open that. Okay, I'm gonna try to wrap the cup. Oh my god. Wait, this is cute. Straws, snackies, bracelet, card, and gift card. I don't even have a pen. Pinch and shake method. It's so cute. Okay, let's go give it. Hello. Yo, what up? I'm dropping Hazel off to get surgery. She has a cyst on her head that they have to surgically remove. <laughs> raining that'd be cute to get her some of her favorite things i got her this cuddler bed i just want her to be comfy when we take her home got her a new blankie she loves this material i don't know how to describe it but it's super soft and plush most of all her toys have names so this is spot and spot is very cute got her a lick mat for yogurt and stuff for obvious reasons i had to buy these this whole thing makes me so sad and then she's gonna have a cone a cone Hi, baby. Resetting my entire house part seven. Now I'm gonna restock the guest bathroom. The bathroom's really small, so I'm gonna put everything in these acrylic drawers and make a guest bath cart. On the first shelf, I'm doing shampoo and conditioner. A lot of few different kinds because I wanted them to have options, you know. Lastly, hair masks. Next shelf is gonna hold these cute mini razors. Oh my gosh. Shave cream. And body wash. Last shelf has bath fish, sugar cubes, and loofahs. I don't know. I almost forgot. Please enjoy this ASMR by Honey Bobo. Now I'm gonna fill the drawers. This one's gonna be for skincare. Mini micellar water. Oh my. Is it micellar water? Cleanser. Serums and moisturizer. In the back, I'm doing face rollers, wax kits, mighty patches, and cleansing balls. Top ones for extra washcloths. This one's for hair. I got some extra brushes, bobby pins, and hair ties. This one's body slash hair, so I have some deodorant. Running out of time. Lotion. Olaplex. Dry shampoo. Chapstick. Toothbrush. Toothpaste. Mouthwash. Cloth. Also made a manicure bin. That's basically it. Next, I'm gonna try and organize my pantry. It's really bad, so I don't know if it's gonna getting my nails done couldn't decide between these two so i asked you guys on instagram and this one was They're so cute i'm just gonna hope for the best
I picked out all the colors except yellow and green, and I was called complicated. I'm so confused. I'm done. She kept burning me with the drill, and every time it would be like, oop, or ow, she would look at me and laugh. I can't make this stuff up. They cut me with the drill. Trigger warning, I'm gonna show you that. Look at that. Like, ow, it was bleeding earlier. Maybe she was nervous? There was a girl next to me, watching her laugh at me. Girl. Anyways, here's what we have so far. They had a mustard yellow and a lime green. I tried to see if they can mix white in it to make it look more pastel, and it just looked like caca, so I told her I would do these on my own. I'm gonna mix these two colors with white. Well, wish me luck. Okay, okay. Never mind, it was way too clumpy. No cute nails for Kelly, I guess. At this point, I'll go somewhere else, and I'll post a picture of them when they're done on my Instagram. First thing in the morning, because I'm not staying like this. It's hot. I'm gonna try some of your favorite drinks at Starbucks. Please be good. Hi, can I please get a cup of cream cold foam and caramel, please? Sorry, um, those cars behind you, I heard literally- A cream cold foam and caramel, please? I want that, like, in, like, a, uh, like a grande cup? Yes, please, thank you. That caramel drizzle in the cup, or- Um, yes, please. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. This is gonna be so freaking awkward. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Eleanor, let's give this a try. Mmm, so good. Hi, can I get a grande dragon fruit refresher with sweet? So unfortunately, uh, we're all out of our dragon fruit. Oh! Have all the other refreshers still. I had to order this instead. Oh, Lily, I didn't even know this existed. Okay, here we go. Wow, this is so good. Please do not do this at home. Let me do it for you. Okay. Plugged in. You know what's stuck in my head? Girl, don't do it. It's not worth it. Putting some parchment paper down and I'm gonna use tweezers so I don't burn myself. I'm not gonna do it, girl. I was just thinking about it. I'm not gonna do it. Putting another piece on top and gonna close it. Oh my god. Ew, it stinks, but that's what it looks like. I'm holding it like this until it cools down. Wait, okay, did I do it? <gasps> okay. Tried to put it on and it broke. Hold on, let me make another one. I'm gonna try to do my name. I did it, but they're so easy to break. Watch. Whoops. Um, very creative though. Hi, Hazel. Yeah, come, come. You have too many toys. It's partly my fault, but still. We need a declutter. Oh, ballerina. Good girl. I got a smaller toy bin from Home Goods. Whatever I can't fit in there is going to get donated. We're definitely keeping this elephant. Just going to put it in there. Yeah. What about this skateboard? Are we keeping it? I'm just going to slowly put it in there. You're literally... You have... It's not Easter anymore, okay? Can I at least have the bunny? We're getting nowhere. We're for sure keeping your Capri Sun. She's distracted. She loves this pool party toy. Oh, walked out. Like, okay. No, she loves the bear and raccoon. Keep and Craig. Oh, welcome back, I guess. She's not really into burrow toys anymore. This one has crabs in it. It's so cute, but she doesn't play with them. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. I'm just gonna take everything out. Which ice cream cone do you want to keep? Okay, we'll keep that one. Balls are her favorite, so I'm keeping all of them. Keeping the sunscreen because it's cute. Yay, you did it. High five. Yo, what up? I love the way I organize my makeup and skincare. It's so convenient until I have to do my everyday makeup. I basically use the same products every day, so I have to go through every single drawer just to find them. So I got these bathroom trays to put the product. Uh, this is the next day, guys. I can't go. I'm gonna put the products I'm currently using on them, so I only have to go to one spot. Vanity drawer. Vanity. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna try the drawer first. Starting with makeup, my favorite primer right now is this one. ColourPop Tinted Moisturizer, I'm always using these. It's gonna chill in the back, but I'm gonna put my beauty blenders in it. Fenty Contour Stick, It Cosmetics Blush. More blush by ColourPop. Benefit and NYX for my brows. I use clear mascara on my brows too. Better than sex mascara. I'm actually gonna put the smaller items in here so it looks less cluttered. Baking and translucent powder. Too Faced Lip Injection and NARS Lip Tint together. Yes. An eyelash curler. And some setting sprays. I forgot to change it to three minutes, so really quick, this is skincare. Bye. Now everything is all in one spot and I can switch out products when I want. Getting my nails done. I can't decide between this one or this one. This is the closest I'll get to a bee theme because I'm actually pretty afraid of them. So or this one. Ah! Well, that didn't go well. Here they are, I guess. Okay, well, long story short, I'm going to try and fix them myself. Update, I went somewhere else. The nail tech was like, who did your nails? Because there was extra acrylic all along my... Oh, it was so bad. I just went with what I had before. I just want one set person to go to. So if you're a nail tech, DM me. The last time I was part of a pay it forward chain, I was having what seemed like the worst day of my life. which is all coming down to me all at once. And I remember saying, you know what? I don't even care anymore. I'm going to treat myself to Starbucks because I need something to cheer me up. When I found out the person in front of me paid for my drink, I cannot explain to you in words how much that meant to me that day. It just goes to show that random acts of kindness can really make a difference in someone's day. And that's why today I'm going to a couple of Starbucks drive throughs and I'm going to start my own pay it forward chains in hopes to make someone's day. I've done this before and I always get so excited. I'm hoping this makes his day and maybe it inspires him to do something kind for someone else. Hi, I'm trying to spread some joy this holiday. Can I pay for the person behind me? Thank you. Also, 
I think he's waving hi. Bye. Yay, they look so happy. Next location. Thank you so much. And can I pay for the person behind me? Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Five. That was so much fun. I encourage you to go out there and do something nice for someone. Even if it's holding the door open, spread joy in any way you can. It really does go a long way. Yo, what up? I'm still trying to become that girl, and I can't be that girl without an aesthetic Spotify playlist, so I made one. Hyper-specific playlist check. It is called When I Randomly Want to Become That Girl at 3 a.m. A lot of these songs are aesthetic and motivating, but we have the occasional because it's 3 a.m. For example, we have Breadwinner next to I Am, next to Flashing Lights, next to Good For You. Imagine cleaning your room to happier than ever, and then you hear Fast Car, and then all of a sudden you're writing in your bullet journal, that is 3 a.m. energy. I kind of want to make more of these, but I need ideas, so comment below your hyper-specific playlist that you've made or you think I should make. Grab a bowl, pour in a big bag of M&Ms, add in two eggs, I'm just trusting the process, and one bag of vanilla cake mix. I broke my whisk, so I'm just using this giant fork. I found this recipe on Pinterest, and it was just a video, so instructions were not included, so I'm on my own from here, I guess. I just don't see this going well for me, so let's preheat to about 350, that sounds about right. I'm just gonna leave it in here for like 10 to 15 minutes. That was 15 minutes, and I'm hoping the bottom didn't burn. Wow! Now just cut it in a circle, and now you know how to make a cookie cake. Let's try. It looks good. Look at that. Mm. Okay, here we go. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's so good. It's Hazel's birthday and she's one years old now. <laughs> She's growing up. Let's make her some treats. Grab about a cup of watermelon, put it in a blender, and then add two scoops of plain yogurt. And we're blending! Once it looks like this, grab some molds and pour it in. I'm just using a measuring spoon. Aren't these molds so cute? For the next treat, all you need is one or two strawberries. Smash them with a fork and then put them in the mold, but don't fill it all the way. Fill the rest of it up with plain yogurt. Now put them in the freezer for a few hours. I also got her this gift and I put a little bow on it. One more gift I have to pick up, but her reaction to everything deserves a video on its own, so I'll see you later today. Redecorating my living room part five. All of the lights I ordered off of Amazon are finally here. I'm so excited because it's gonna look so good. First I ordered these Philips Hue lights and I found these really cute lamps at Ikea that I'm gonna put them in. I'm putting one at the very top and bottom for each lamp. I am on the floor now. Where is my inhaler? I'll show you the whole thing at the end. It's gonna be worth it. Now I'm gonna work on these LED strip lights. This first box is going behind the TV. I really hope I'm doing this right, especially with the corners. Please tell me there's a better way. You know what? I'm just gonna trust the process. The second box is going behind the TV stand. Oh. My gosh, this is so cool. I told you it was going to be worth it. So all I have to do now is hide all of those cables. Yikes. Then put a rug down and all of my decorations. So I will see you in part six. Yo, what up? I'm going to try to make a coffee candle. I don't know what I'm doing, but I've been winging it my whole life and it's gotten me this far. So that's what I'm going to do. First, I'm making the caramel drizzle. So I'm melting some wax for that. I'm heating up the jar and Hazel's going crazy. Now I'm just adding in a few drops of this candle wax dye and a few drops of this caramel latte scent. I'm waiting for this to cool down a little bit and my plan is to put it in this piping bag. <laughs> it worked. It actually worked. I'm using clear gel wax as my ice. Now I'm making the coffee. Here goes nothing. I'm trying to make a creamy brown color. I'm so excited. My place is going to smell like coffee all the time. I'm so scared. I don't want to mess this up. Here we go. Oh my gosh. There we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's so cute. Now let's make the whipped cream. I broke up a whole bunch of tea light candles and I'm gonna melt them in the microwave. Now I'm just whisking it and then I'm gonna put it in this piping bag. Okay, it kind of looks like whipped cream. Oh my god. Wow, it looks so real. It smells so good. It's so cute. Yo, what up? I got a package in the mail today from Miles. This is a swap, so I have no idea what's inside here, so I'm excited. All I know is that the theme is self care. Can I just say, this box smells like blueberries. It smells so good. Oh my gosh, I love this. Kind people are my kind of people. Oh, I love anything watermelon. Is this Haribo or Haribo? How do you pronounce that? This is so cute. It's a makeup brush cleaning mat. And it ha oh, it sticks onto your wall. Oh, mirror the counter is what I was trying to say. This is a lychee sleeping mask. Oh, some chocolate. I've never had these before. This is so fun. You guys should tag a creator you want me to swap with next. I'm trying to figure out what smells so good. We got some eye masks. I love strawberry pocky. Oh my gosh. Next we have this. It's like wrapped up. Let me unwrap wrap it real quick <gasps> no you freaking didn't miles it's wet there's still so much in the box i'm gonna have to do a part two but it should be up right now
Part five of the mystery box Daniela sent me. I wanted to do a close up of all the candy she sent me. Like, look at these cocktail gummies and a cocktail lollipop. Some Lucas powder candy. I used to get these from the ice cream truck when I was little. Kool Aid, Warhead, soda candy. Oh my gosh. These are so good. Next is this. It's wrapped so cute. It's a cocktail shaker set with the little umbrellas and the freaking cactuses. Some fruit discs, Kool Aid gummies, the more sour belts, and this Christmas tree racer. It's so cute. Oh, it's for your pencil. I knew it. I knew you were going to go for the ball. <laughs> Excuse me, she be eating. <laughs> no, I can't have that. That one's not for you. Girl, thank you so much for everything. And again, show her some love at Candy Boulevard because, oh, she got some good candy. Oh my gosh, I just can't stop looking at everything. This is just so sweet. Yo, what up? I just woke up. Broke off all my nails last night, so I'm getting them done tomorrow. Can't decide what I want, so I'm gonna let the top comment choose for me. I forgot I bought these, so let's open them because I'm freaking bored. I'm looking for Lunchables and Capri Sun if they have. Okay, that's a shopping cart. What is this? Not a lunchable. Nope. No, but the baby bell is really cute. I refuse to do a part two. Speed round. No. Nope. 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 Kool-Aid. That's close enough. Come on, lunchable. How many times am I going to get this one? Nope. No. This is my last one. Come on, I just want a little lunchable. Nope. Things are not looking <laughs> Okay, well, all that for nothing. Well, Kool-Aid. My sister is really crafty, so I'm going to give them to her and see what she makes. I found these at Walmart while I was shopping for a really cool recipe video I'm posting tonight. I'm almost positive Courtney has done a video on these. I'm going to tag her because her content just makes my day. I'm just going to read the ones that are kind of funny. Cop tarts. Yeah. <clears throat> More on salt. Oh my gosh, look. This one's shaped like a cereal box. So I went, ah, this one's cute. Rice Krispies. Bing mints. Okay, we're getting to the good stuff. This feels like a candy bar. Oh my gosh, I can't open it. There we go. Ah, dang it. Two milk drones and peas. And the last one feels like a bottle of sauce. Fish bone. If you turn your screen with me, that's everything. The only one I really liked was the Rice Krispies. Yo, what up? I'm gonna try. This is gonna go so bad. To make a snow globe glitter cup. Here's my glitter. Yikes. I also got some strawberries because grab some strawberries. You know, because of the recipes, grab some strawberries. Elmer's glue. Resin. Whatever it's called. Alcohol wipes. Distilled water. I forgot to buy a drill. Well, at least now, now you know how to make a glitter cup. I'm gonna make this video tomorrow, so excuse me while I go buy myself a new drill. I have to try this. Grab some Oreos. You'll need about 27. Put them in a Ziploc bag and crush them. I've been through a lot the last few days. Set that aside, grab a pot, pour in one bag of white chocolate chips, and a can of sweetened condensed milk. Put that on the stove on medium heat. Constantly stir it until it's melted. Take it off the heat and add in your Oreos. Mix it all together and then pour it into a baking dish and flatten it out. Um, oh my god. I forgot the parchment paper. If you want, you can add extra Oreo pieces to the top. Leave it in your fridge for a few hours and I'll see you in I'm just kidding. There's not gonna be a part two. Yes, it's been a few hours. Now I gotta cut it into squares. Now you know how to make Oreo fudge. Let's try it. <laughs> how do you guys do that? Okay, here we go. Wow, it's really good and it's really chewy. I didn't, I thought it was gonna be hard as rock. Oh my god, I just hit a million followers. Thank you so much. I tried to scream, but my head was underwater. They called me weak, like I'm not just somebody's daughter. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see your cheeks glow red, red, red. <laughs>peanut butter mix it i'm not trying to make anything gourmet so we're gonna use the microwave mix every 15 seconds until it's melted i'll grab a pan and line it with parchment paper and pour the chocolate in this one is a 7 by 11 spread that evenly and freeze it for about 20 minutes grab another bowl add in one cup of powdered sugar one cup of marshmallow fluff oh my God, and one fourth cup of peanut butter mix it i just used my hands and it should feel like dough when you're done put it on top of the first layer and even it out now take some peanuts and layer that on top Gently press them in. Set that aside and grab about a cup of soft caramel. Melt it in your microwave and mix every 15 seconds. Once it's melted, spread it on top as fast as you can and then push it in. The last layer is the same as the first one. One cup of chocolate chips, one fourth cup peanut butter, and melt it. Whee! Okay, almost almost dropped that. Put it in your freezer for 20 minutes. Cut them up and now you know how to make homemade Snickers. Let's try them. Okay, here we go.
grab a bowl. I broke all of mine and I broke my nails, but this will work. Add in two cups of heavy whipping cream. Whisk it and it should look like this when you're done. Now add in one cup of condensed milk. And a fourth of a cup of sour Kool-Aid. Mix it. Zang! It's so pretty. Put it in a squeeze bottle or a Ziploc bag. Grab a pan and some parchment paper and start making little dots. It's gonna be tedious, but that's not a dot. Okay, one second. Ow, 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 ow. Put it in your freezer for a few hours. I'm putting the rest of it in this ice cream container I got at Target. And now we wait. Okay, it's been a few hours. And they're done. Well, I feel like I should have made more. Now you know how I attempted to make dots. Which are now called dip and dots. Okay. Here we go. Mm -mm. After three hours of looking for this glitter, I found more and hopefully it works this time. Universe, hear me. Yo, what up? I need this glow in the dark cup. <laughs> now I'm just putting the tape on. I'm not sure if liquid is the way to go. I'm just gonna wing it and fill the whole thing. Pushing in the cabinet bumper. Yes, God. I'm cleaning it with an alcohol pad before the resin. I'm using UV resin this time and my nail lamp. I don't know if that's okay to do. I guess we'll find out here in a second. <laughs> That smells so bad. Look it up and it's normal. Thank goodness. I'm going to open a window. I'm also sealing this one. Oh my gosh. I did it. Okay, let's test it. This is what it looks like normally. This is the other one I made. It's like a snow globe. Hold on, let me shake it. Oh, do it, guys. Just do it. Mike, welcome to the fam. Okay, you guys are going to kill me. Um, I found a few more. We have the gridded pink and blue cup. It looks like a disco ball. Look at the straw. And I found the red and purple one. Look how cute they're sisters! I found the confetti cup! <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wow. I also got one that has swirls on it. I just want to say that this makes me happy. It just makes me happy. Oh, I don't know what I've done, but this just, it makes me happy for some reason. Part two, let's take it out of the freezer. Flip the dish upside down, it should just pop right out. Place them on parchment paper and cut them like this. Grab a bowl, two cups of chocolate chips, and one teaspoon of coconut oil. Now put it in your microwave-y. <laughs> I'm just kidding, it's microwave. And mix every 15 seconds. I added one more teaspoon of coconut oil so I can get a thinner consist consistency. Wow. Now just spread the chocolate all over the bars. <laughs> I know these don't look the best right now, but just trust the process. Stick them in your freezer for 20 minutes. Take them out, and now you know how to make homemade Twix. Let's try them. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. Wow! Pretty close to a real Twix. You can add more graham cracker to give it more of like a snap. Like a real Twix, but other than that, that's pretty good. Welcome to my closet. Wow. This really shows how short I am. We're going to play two truths and a lie. One, I'm learning how to box. Two, I'm getting lip injections. R.I.P. those thin lips, Say, eh? No, that's not what I mean. And three, Hazel has never had a snow cone. I'm revealing one truth tonight, and I have no hints for you. Sorry. If you're ever up at three o'clock in the morning, hit me up. I'll be awake. Here's another one of those purchases. It's a retro milkshake maker. Let me show you the best milkshake combo. I like to do about four scoops of ice cream. One banana. It says to blend it, so I just smashed it with a fork. The amount of milk depends on how thick you want it. I'm just doing half a cup. And some crushed Oreos. I just realized I've been yelling this entire time. I'm sorry. Nothing beats a milkshake at one o'clock in the morning, though. Okay, you're supposed to, like, clip it onto here. I'm so excited. I hope this works. <laughs> okay, I even got... Ooh. I even got a cute milkshake cup. Let's pour it in. Ooh, it's kind of clumpy. I'm adding some whipped cream and some Oreos on top. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Let's try it. I already know what this tastes like because I make it all the time, but let's talk texture. Okay. Oh, this is good. It's really, really thick is what I mean. <laughs> I need to go to bed. Grab some strawberries, wash them, grab a small spoon, take your spoon and cut into the strawberry, but not all the way, and pull out. Do this until you make your way around the whole thing. Don't mind my nails, by the way. Now that you have your first layer, start higher up and make a second layer. Once it looks like this, you can either leave the top like that or cut it in half. Now grab a skewer and poke it into the bottom of the strawberry. Put a whole bunch in a vase, and now you know how to make a strawberry rose bouquet. Every Mother's Day, I like to make my mom a DIY gift basket because she loves anything DIY. I'm doing a Mother's Day series. You can see how I make and what my mom's basket ends up looking like this year, so hopefully you can pull some ins. I'm cleaning my entire house on my Instagram stories right now, so if you've ever wanted to see what my house actually looks like, go follow me on Instagram. There's probably 20 plus videos on there already, so if you're bored and want something to do, let's hang out and clean my house. Anyway, I'm already bored of the way my bathroom looks, so we're going to redecorate it again. Just stick down.
The shower curtain and liner, now I'm putting up a new one. I'm using actual curtains, but my mom inspired me to do it like this, so that way I can open them like that, maybe hook it onto the side, I don't know. I just took out the old bath mats, and these are the new ones. These are the towels I'm using. <laughs> I can't go on, I'm sorry. This is a redecorating fail. Like, what? I don't even know where I'm going with this. If you guys can comment some ideas, I would appreciate it. It existed, but yeah. This one is so pretty, one of my favorites, but I feel like it should have been released during Christmas time because don't they look like ornaments? Just saying. This is the most aesthetic cup I have. It reminds me of that little circle thing. This. Got this one too, I like it more. Color changing mystery cups and I'm trying to find all five colors. I don't have any ice, but chicken bakes are working just fine. Oh my gosh, yes. The only one I need to find is orange because I got two reds. It's actually not 3 a.m. so I can try these. They're sun activated cups. I don't see an Aubrey effect, but maybe with a drink in it. You know what I'm saying? Like that does not look like that. But anyway. Yo, what up? Let's restock my house. And be that girl while doing it. Cute place for toilet paper. I mean, go mom. Scent beads. I'm putting my fruit in a sealed container this time. You guys said it would last longer, so I'm gonna try. Raspberries, blackberries, blueberries, and strawberries. Honestly, I never buy these. I just really wanted to. Do that wow flower i always make the biggest mess it's not even funny chunky chips ahoy microwave them for 10 seconds look at this masterpiece beautiful capri sun because i'm addicted cucumbers and grappas now i'm just restocking the lemons for my lemonade bar. toilet wand refills that's it for now. Next, I gotta restock my beauty room and clean it because it's a mess. Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. I don't even know what Stony Clover Lane is, but I saw an ad for it before it dropped and I had to go get it because, I mean, come on. First, this cooler. Yeah. Stella, you need me. And that's why I bought it. Dog toy leash and bandana for Hazel. Okay, hold on. I think she likes it. This cute paddle set. I found these patches and duffel bag. I'm gonna put them on right now. There we go. I guess you just stick them on. Oh my gosh. Wait. Now I'm doing cherries for the fifth time. I can't get it centered. I feel like it's. I think I got it. I don't know. But, anyways, I got this bag too. It's so cute. Next, this clear backpack and a beach bag. Sandals and a beach towel. Lastly, these cups. The straws are heart shaped. And I got a charm set. I feel like I need a new routine. I can't keep doing this. I understand how the time changes so fast. Like, I feel like I've only been standing here for a minute. That's probably my sign to go. Spring cleaning part four, the pantry. Viewer discretion advised. Yeah, <laughs> So bad. Oh. I'm gonna start by taking everything out of the pantry and putting it on the counter. I knew it. I knew we had pepper. I kept going to the store to buy more. This side of the pantry is done and I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. There's still a whole other side. And I'm done. And it moves on a shelf. Now I'm going to organize everything. I'm going to have a pile for keeping and a pile for donating. Now that everything is kind of organized, I'm going to take this method cleaner and spray the wired shelves down. And we're vacuuming! Now that the cleaning is done, I can start organizing and decorating. I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and I got this can tracker. It can hold 54 cans. So I'm going to put this at the bottom shelf and we're going to start to fill it. This did not make sense to me at first, but now it does and it's really cool. So you put the can on and then you just push it and it aligns with the bottom. How did I not know this existed? That's all of my cans. Now I just have to put things in the buckets and label them. I'll see you in a couple of hours. Resetting my entire house part four, I got a desk. What? Way better than my bed. I'm going to be so productive. Since I have no drawers, I got these from Target and I'm going to use them to organize everything. Let's enjoy this ASMR by Honey Bubba. This one's going to hold highlighters. Gel pens. Last one is for editing. It's going to hold batteries, SD cards, headphones. So I just put my desk in this room. Now I'm going to decorate the wall. The lighting is so bad in here, but it's so cute so far. And I put that up. Fast forward, I added lights. I stacked these two because I thought it would look better. And now I'm adding a plan. I usually have my to-do list on my phone, but I thought this was so cute. I got it off Amazon. That's going right there. Lastly, an ice cream candle. I'm going to be so productive, hopefully. Next up, I'm restocking my mini fridge. Yo, what up? Hang out with me at Playlist. Let's go to karaoke. Karaoke! 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 purchases well if you only have one bag this time and that's because all the other cups were not it but this one how cute it is oh my gosh it's my new favorite i know i say that a lot but okay this one it looks normal right bam portal <laughs> i was craving peeps and then i don't know what happened after that inflating oh my gosh 
gosh, I love peeps. I'm gonna cry. Mostly because it's almost 4 a.m., but still, it's so cute. Pretty sure it goes outside, but I'm gonna keep it in my living room. Anyways, I got a desk and a few things for it, so I'm gonna be setting that up next, so I will see you tomorrow. Yo, what up? I got two packages from TikTok. Oh my god. Bottom one is kind of heavy, so I'm gonna open the top one first. I'm so excited. This is so cute! Oh my gosh! This is so cute! Okay, I'm gonna read the card. So they sent gifts and products from Latinx owned brands to show appreciation and celebration of Latinx creators. Thank you so much, TikTok. I'm gonna FaceTime my mom and be like, I got the junk shot. Shirt, a hat, some stickers and tattoos, and then this box. Whoa. Whoa. That is really cool. This one was so good. I'm scared to open this one. <laughs> I'm sorry. Calm, Kelly. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. This is so sweet. Very thoughtful. I feel so supported. We have some bum bum cream, some coffee, this cute tote bag, and I cannot wait to try these hair care products. And this candle smells amazing. And we got some good chips. Thank you, TikTok. Part two, I'm at the nail salon. Let's see if they can fix this. Okay, square one, they removed the polish. I asked them to remove the whole thing. They said they can't, so I'm stuck with this. I fought them for a refund over the phone. They kept telling me no, then I got there. I almost left and walked out the door once they took my nail polish off, and then they said, we'll give you half your money back. <laughs> at this point, I'm done. Let's see, if the, on. let's see if the next place can help me. Do I even dare ask for this, or should I just go with a solid color? <laughs> okay, I got something even better, ready? <laughs> They're so cute, finally tipped very well they're so cute please they compliment my skin color and just oh my gosh it's just so beautiful finally i'm getting my nails done again this is what i'm asking for or these i can't decide so here's the before just wait for it why do they always just break off i have never wanted to cry coming out of a nail salon first of all they were so rude to me second of all this is how they left me just I mean, some of the nails are okay, but there's fuzzies, and every nail, you can kind of see it on this one. The thumb is fine, but look how bumpy the rest of them are. They're literally bumpy. They kept burning me with the drill, and it took a total of three hours. One of them was me waiting in the waiting area. My choice, it's fine, but... <sighs> to top it off, I have gel top coat. You can see it right there, kind of. All over my hands, like, all over. Okay, I just got back. They said they would redo it for me. Oh! I don't know what I did. Like, I don't know why they're just being so rude to me, but... I don't know if I should go back because I just feel so uncomfortable. Like, oh, what do I do? I'm done with the smoothie bar. I'm gonna make a lemonade bar. It's 11 11, make a wish. Making this into a lemonade slash refresher bar. I don't know what else to call it. These kind of look like fish bowls. I feel like there's a popcorn kernel stuck in my gum. And I can't get it out. I'm filling the first jar with monk fruit. This one's gonna have freeze dried strawberries. Oops. Can't forget the mangoes, blueberries. This is for a thumbnail. Raspberries for the last one. Life hack I put a Ziploc bag in here to make this jar look more full. Ah psych like wait this is so cute okay I got this from home goods and i'm gonna put the lemons in it now i'm just topping off the honey i got these mini reusable straws from target and i'm just putting them in this jar stirring sticks and my favorite tea oh my god well this is the best one we're almost at five million i'll get a tattoo if we can hit five mil in the next 10 seconds here's another one of my 3 a.m purchases <laughs> waited outside for three hours in the dark for cups well, this is the first one. She cute, she cute. Okay, this one's kind of ugly, but I didn't want to have FOMO, so I got her anyway. I think I'm going to trade it for something I do like. This was my favorite one. Oh, girl. Hi, you guys must have gotten here pretty early, huh? I just pulled up like five minutes ago. Oh, look, they're opening the doors. Yeah, someone did that, and they got a whole bunch of these. I got this blue stainless steel one. The straw, though, it's so cute. Like, everything matches. I usually don't get water bottles, but this one was so cute. Am I right? Like, they all go together. <laughs> This one was so hard to find, so I hope I don't break it because it's glass. I also found this one. These remind me of Jello, so I've been calling them the Jello Cup. Don't know what I feel about this one. I might do a trade. And this one, also a trade. Now I get to organize them. I'm so excited. What? Hazel has never had a snow cone, so we're gonna go get her first snow cone. Okay, so it's basically like ice, right? But it's like shaved ice, you know? Let's go! Got my purse and her leash. Snow cone! <laughs> She'll only eat it out of my hand. I think she's done. <laughs> Yo, what up? I haven't done laundry in about a month, but I thought it'd be a good idea to refill on the supplies and maybe I'll be motivated to do it. Please enjoy ASMR by Honey Boba Bear, episode one. Laundry. That's a long title. Next we have scent beads. Oh my god. <laughs> Dryer sheets.
okay that's everything let's put it back in my laundry room also thank you for all the love in my last video i promise i'm okay i was just really tired well i'm gonna get started on laundry Bye. why does it have to be like this i finally found pickled garlic oh my gosh whoa dude you just get used to the smell after a while hi yay yay please be good please chili powder it kind of looks like pasta and time maybe some more sriracha oh my i think it's ready Oh, come on. Okay, here we go. Take him out of the freezer. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. She's gonna love them. I'm gonna store them in a mason jar. These are the cutest dog treats I've ever seen. Just set everything up. Let's see if she likes her treats. Ready? Okay. <laughs> you like it. She's very gentle when she eats, so she's not gonna take a big bite out of it. Let's see if she likes the watermelon one. Yep. <laughs> she's so cute. Girl, high five. <laughs> Time to open presents! Here's a look! Go through it! Toy! Oh my gosh, she's so happy right now. <laughs> get it out, baby! Oh my gosh! I gotta open these for you! How else did you get? A mini pool! <laughs> Here you go, baby! Happy birthday! Part two, I gotta finish putting these on. That took forever. They're on now, let's put them up. A lot of you said I should store these horizontally, which makes sense, so I'll just fix them later, and then I'll update you on my Instagram or something. This is the last one. I'm so excited! <gasps> wow! Oh, it's not perfect, but I'm just happy I came out decent. I'm starting to draw on it and I've already messed up. These markers are not the best, but this is my fifth time doing this, so it is what it is. I'm also making a calendar, which is the main reason why I wanted a chalkboard, and I think it looks really cute so far. Yay, I'm done! I went a little overboard with all the colors because I was really excited about them, but I love this thing so much, and I think I'm going to redo it. But for now, this looks great and I can't wait to fill it out. I'm still trying to become that girl, and I can't be that girl if I keep buying things at 3 a.m. Ice cream band-aids. Um, the box alone is so cute, but then look at the band-aids. Uh, printed fruit rinsing thingies. I don't know. I just put cherries in them. This Pisces candle, because I'm a Pisces. Because what a day, and I dropped it. But my bestie. Yeah. Flower sponge and AirPods case. This is my favorite one. It's a fluffy journal, but it's, like, checkered. It's so cute. A self-care book, because a milk frother, and it comes with a stand. Ready? Oh a bubble vase for a flower, a tulip. I don't know. What I ordered, what I got. I thought it was going to be the same size as a normal <laughs> Lastly, um, a cloud pillowcase and that candle. I'm gonna go clean that. Resetting my entire life. First, I'm getting my ears pierced. I'm so scared. While this yeah. <laughs> my dots are on. I'm still scared. I'm gonna faint. How was it? <laughs> oh, it looks cute. Oh. Okay. okay. What do you guys think? I'm gonna try and make a that girl tote bag. I got this one at Cotton On. It's so cute. First, a hair clip. I'm going with this blue one. Sunscreen. Yeah. AirPods. I can't decide between this case or this one with a smiley face. I'll just bring both. I don't even know where I'm going. Glossier or Glossier. I've never had this brand before, but hand cream. Now, some aesthetic rings. I chose these flower ones. Essentially, everything's supposed to match. So, I'm doing a pink smiley face necklace and angel number. Aesthetic lip products. We have chapstick, lip plump, lip oil, and lip gloss. Snacks. And just pretend I didn't just eat those. Sunglasses, but I can't decide. Do I match the sunscreen or the lip gloss? Hmm. I made paper ones. It's for the vision. Perfume matches the hair clip. Mascara that matches the ring. And cloud paint. And gum. And some bracelets. And a scrunchie. This Plant. Putting all the makeup in this bag. Yes. Love your carpet. I was going somewhere with that, but never mind. Anyways, okay, I think I did pretty good. Step a that girl sick routine. Whoa. Yo, what up? I'm gonna try and make Valentine's Day themed mystery gift bags for my sister and niece. So yeah. each bag has a theme, so I'm starting with self care. I got them both strawberry sugar scrub. It's my new favorite. It smells so good. Face mask, this lip care set, and bath bombs. Next bag is DIY themed. Got them cake pop kits. They're so cute. This is random, but I got my mom a grow your own strawberry patch kit. I'm excited. Next bag is candy. Please enjoy this ASMR. Just kidding, that was very bad. It is 2 a.m. though. The next bag is something cute, so I found a teddy bear holding a marshmallow on a stick. Forget the s'mores kit, that's cute. And then this donut and milk. I think that's milk, I'm not sure, but it's really cute. Now I'm gonna put heart shaped candy boxes in the big bag. Another donut plush. And a chocolate bar, it's really soft. Lastly, for my niece, I got a color changing salt lamp, watermelon body glaze, and a daisy grow kit. For my sister, I got a journal and some sharpies, flower grow kit, and a Fruit Loops body glaze. Now I'm adding tissue paper, red for my sister, and pink for my niece. They look so good, I can't wait to see their reactions. Also, I did one through five, and they'll open up one per day till Valentine's Day.
Why? Just why? Here's another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. Also, I just got my nails done. I love that. Basically a giant cube that lights up and you can use it as a chair. But I'm going to use it as a nightstand. Just kidding, a chair. Just kidding, it's 4 a.m. and I can't decide. What? Oh my gosh. Can you imagine the pictures? <laughs> this is why I shop at 3 a.m. Okay, do I use it as a nightstand or a vanity chair? Also, if you want one, search Glow Cube Chair on Amazon. It'll pop right up. Or if you want a link, I'll put it on my Amazon page in my bio. This is so last minute, but I'm going to try and wrap gifts as that girl. First, I'm wrapping everything in white gift wrap. I suck at wrapping, so I'm using boxes now. Don't know why that took me two hours. Anyway, now I'm going to try and draw an aesthetic pattern on each box. Wish me luck. First two done, they're cow print. I don't even know what this one is. This one's cute from far away, but when you get close. I'm using a chalk marker for this one. This one's going to be like a drippy smiley face. Yeah. This one's kind of cute. Oh my gosh. Putting a silver bow on all of them, and now I'm going to put them under the tree. Are you ready to open presents? You don't even know what's going on. Hazel's going to be opening all her gifts on Instagram stories, so I'll see you there. I'm so excited. I got a Chime debit card and it came in the mail today. Chime is one of the best financial apps to help you manage, save, and spend your money. With Chime, I finally don't have to worry about all those hidden fees. We've become so used to paying with traditional financial institutions. They've got my back. Chime offers fee-free overdraft up to $200 in debit purchases with SpotMe. It's like overdraft protection, but better. And instead of waiting on payday for your money, you can get your paycheck up to two days early with direct deposit. The best part is, I know the money in my account is safe and sound because Chime uses two-factor authentication and supports fingerprint and face ID on the app. You can even block your card in a single tap if it goes missing or notice charges that aren't yours. In 2021, you can't get more secure than that. Signing up for my Chime debit card was a piece of cake and I can't wait to start using it. Wow. I was told Very Very Hibiscus is back, so I'm at Starbucks. Hi, can I get a very, very hibiscus refresher with extra berries, please? And can you make that a venti size, please? I'm so excited. I haven't had one of these in a couple of months, so yay. Here we go. Ah, yeah. Wow. Wow. It's really good. Yes. I feel like I can do anything. Trick or treat. I have to be at a Halloween party in an hour, so I, I'm, gonna, blah, 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 I'm gonna make some last minute treats. One bag of brownie mix, fourth of a cup of water, one egg, and a third of a cup of veggie oil. Mix and spray a cupcake pan with Pam. Preheat your oven to 325 and leave them in there for like 35 minutes. Yeah, don't fill them too much, they're going back in now. I'll grab a bowl and fill it with cream cheese frosting. Add in some green food coloring. Once you take them out of the oven, grab an ice cream scoop and press down to create a bowl shape. Mix and put it into one of these things, I forgot what they're called. Fill them with frosting. Now I'm just adding big and small pearls. Add a pretzel stick, and now you know how to make bubbling cauldron brownies. They're so cute. I also made these. So cute. Okay, here we go. Oh. Mm. Mm hmm Wow. It's really Yo, what up? I'm in LA. I'm in LA! I'm here to see a mural. <laughs> Honey but bears on a mural. <laughs> oh my gosh! And now I'm sitting on the floor. Literally right there. Honey Boba Bear. Oh my gosh. She's up there somewhere, right there. There we go, where am I pointing? I don't know, it's up there though. You know how a while back I reorganized my entire bathroom? My skin feels so dry. I clearly don't have the right product, so I need to try something else. I'm gonna try Olay's body wash and rinse off body conditioner. Growing up, all my mom ever used was Olay. She still uses it and she is so soft. Goodbye, dry skin. I'm so excited. This stuff smells amazing. This, I still need. It's time for the body conditioner. So far, so good. I'm gonna see how I feel tomorrow. This is only one week later. My skin feels so renewed and hydrated. Yo, yes, I think I found the one. Grab a bowl. Do you guys like it? I got a new one because I broke all of mine. You'll need one and one fourth cup of flour. This is from a while ago, but I'm still laughing at the fact you guys think my mom looks like Cardi B. One fourth cup of sugar. One teaspoon of salt. Add in one stick and a half of butter. Break it up into pieces before you add it in. Mix it all together. It's easier to use your hands. Halfway through mixing, add in four crushed graham crackers. Set that aside. Grab a baking dish and spray it with Pam. Palm. I don't know what to say. Place your dough in and pack it down. Preheat your oven to 350 and leave it in there for about 20 minutes. Grab a cup, fill it with caramel. That's about 45 pieces or one bag. Put it in your microwave for 30 seconds. Then add in one third cup of heavy whipping cream. Back in the microwave, mix every 15 seconds. It helps if you stir kind of fast, but trust the process. Eventually, you'll get something that looks like this. Now spread the caramel all over the first layer. Try to spread it out evenly. Leave it in your freezer for about two hours to set. I'm gonna let that sit. I gotta run some errands anyway, so I'll see you in part two, which will be uploaded tonight. I just need a little bit of time to film it. Look at all this mess!
I've been loving my Case to Five phone case, and I may or may not have ordered a few more. Oops. But how can I not? They're six foot drop proof, so I can drop it on purpose like this, or an accident. Either way, my phone case is going to be protected. See? And I couldn't just get one. There are so many different styles to choose from. I couldn't resist. Like, look at this cow print one. Even celebrities like Kylie Jenner and Dua Lipa use them too. Now I'm going to show you the cases I got. First off, the packaging is beautiful. They even gave me sanitizing wipes to keep my phone clean. And yeah, times three, I got the cow print case. I still can't believe how cute these are. I also got these two. How cute would it be if you got the same case? If you decide to get one, be sure to use my code 15HoneyBoba for 15% off.